Hi Wayne. Whoops. Hello, it's me. Hi Waze, hi Linux. Um, I don't know, I've been slowly working through my goals. I'm uh, I'm like an hour and ten minutes away from 70 herb law. I've got 70 construction banked. Nice. I think that's all I need to do for Song of the Elves. Mm -hmm. Run escape. Hey unicorn. I've done like almost every quest in the game now. I haven't done the new desert quest yet. I don't know if you've done that. I haven't done it yet. We could maybe do it together, or have you not done contact yet? I uh, still need to do some desert quests. Okay. Um, but I've also got Dragon Slayer 2, Kingdom Divided, Monkey Madness 2, Night at the Theater, Sins of the Father, and Song of the Elves. So I've got like the big hitters. And then also Rag and Bone Man 2, of course. Like the hardest yeah. quest in the game. Of course. Yeah. Uh, Kingdom Divided is... the spellbook is quite uh, versatile. People um, say like the quest's really good, so I might just do that. And the quest is really good, yeah. I'm gonna do, you know, I'm gonna do Kingdom Divided quest. How does that sound? I don't think I need anything. I think I've, yeah, I've got everything for it. No, wait, actually, hang on. Do I need? Um. Wait, hang on. Can I do Kingdom Divided? Yeah, I can definitely do that. Fifty-two woodcutting. Mm -hmm. All right. Do you have a hundred percent favor with all the oh, houses? Yeah. yeah, I got that ages ago. Oh, good. Um, spec savers. Then if you wanted, we can try to do theater later. Uh, I have to duck off for a bit in like half an hour, but maybe after that I might be able to come back and we can try to run a few entry mode theater blood blindly. Oh, that might be fun. Like the, um, the blah 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 night at the theater one. Yeah. yeah. That'll be cool. I don't know what gear I've got for that. I've got very little actual cash stack. Currently I'm doing the, maybe the smart thing, but like I've invested all my money the moment it becomes like a decent chunk. So it's all locked away. I've got like, I don't know, a bunch of mill in like these bloody skilling supplies. And then I've got like a dragon pickaxe and a pharaoh scepter and random BS. Hey, unicorn. Thank you. I'm, I'm all I'm all big and chunky. Yeah. Oh, um, I'm a master clue. Yeah, I, I'm waiting until I've had this forever. I was waiting until I finished Song of the Elves to do it. Oh, right, right. Um, This is like the onions one. This is from ages ago. I figured like. They're not that common for me, so I might as well just wait. Um, that'll be a fun, like, oh, I finished all the quests. So I'm assuming I'll do Song of the Elves last. So like, oh, I finished all the quests. Let's do that master clue finally. Hi, Mangle. I know my bank's looking kind of funny, I suppose. Um, there's a lot of money locked away. Like, the Pharaoh Scepter doesn't have a grand exchange value right now, but I think it's like 5 mil or so. 4, five, four five mil. So I think the bank's probably more like 80, 80 mil, and then there's some stuff in like miscellany or whatever. Uh, anyway, I guess I'll do, I'll go to the GE and prep for Kingdom Divided, because that looks like it'll be a fun quest. How is everyone's uh, Monday been? How's everyone doing? How are you, Linux? Uh, recovering from COVID, so could, could COVID? be better, but... <laughs> Good lord, have you been okay? Yeah, it's it's very mild, so I've been... Fine, just a little miserable, but Moy. mostly passed. That's sad. Everyone's you, Tom, bloody ill. There's yeah. some new, but the Grand Exchange. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I've been all right. I've been killing Kraken today, mostly. Ooh, nice. Ooh, uh, yeah, I saw it. Got, got a jar of oh. dirt. Nice. They're probably the. Yeah the least valuable unique but still a unique um then i went to the pub earlier today so see i'm doing okay that's good to hear all right Are the boss fights in this particularly hard um, uh not particularly hard but you do need to be prepared i'll just take my actual melee gear do I want I want graceful for this quest, right? Like it'll be quite obvious when I'm doing the fights, or do I just take my melee gear? I thought it was meant to be get, quite long. You get launched into the first fight rather abruptly, but oh. you can just leave and regear. 
so. No, I'll just, I'll just wear the gear. It's, it's fine. Uh, there's a lot of running beforehand. Oh, is there? You know what then? Yeah, I'll, I'll take a, I'll take like a one tick teleport. The full graceful now is kind of, kind of comfy. I got it like a few weeks ago. Check this out. I look just like every other character in this game now. May the will bring you power. Thank you. Your Monday's been great. You ordered a cheap ThinkPad for uni because you'd rather use a cheap used laptop in a public place than a machine you spent actual money on. Oh, sick. Are you going to um, shove like more RAM in an SSD in it or something? Or are you just leaving it base spec? I like Stu Plays looking for new rune, but like, isn't there a 90% chance that he's like a... He's, he's like a YouTuber doing like a series of like how the best money makers in RuneScape begging for rune at GE. Not recolored graceful. Don't you have to like do a shit ton of agility for the recolor? Uh, no. It's like, isn't it like 30 marks of grace per recolor or something? Or per piece? Uh, for the, for the, the um, friend houses recolors. Some of the other recolors are kind of uh, time consuming. Oh no, it's 90 for the full set. Okay, never mind. That's not so bad, but I have 8 right now. I need to get 73 right. agility uh, at some point. So maybe I'll get it then. Um, I need runes slash equipment for firebolt or better. What? What, just like death and fire and air? Is that fine? Yeah, you just need to like melt some ice, I think. I need what, sorry? It's just to like use on an... Or like a use. piece of ice or something. Yeah, yeah, or something like that. All right, and then I guess the combat gear will be something I would just teleport out from. Dark Essence block, do I need to mine in Arceus? Okay. So that's the rune crafting thing, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Okay, 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 ok, ok, ok. I will grab some, I will put my massive 2 mil cash cash stack back in the bank. Just, just pop that in there for five minutes. You can give it to me for safekeeping if you like. All right, Tom. Sure. <laughs> so it's a very dangerous quest, you know. It's it's best to put your money in capable hands. <laughs> there you go. You just made a sick two hundred and eighty-nine coins from that, Tom. Look, champ. There you go. All right. Um, I've probably got enough random shit for now. I'll go mine that dark essence block, and then I will I will continue with everything else. Can you oh. hear my cat nuzzling my mic? No, but I wish I could. I'm sad now. Alright, I'm gonna go to uh, Arceus. Okay. Arceus? I know it's like, I always call the Pokemon Arceus, but the in-game area feels like such an Arceus. I don't know. Okay. Oh yeah, I did um the fucking uh, Making Friends With My Arm quest the other day. That was, an ama that was amazing. I really liked mm. that quest. It was really good fun. I liked the uh, the writing was really good, and now I'm finally you... using those other two uh, herb spots. Go on, sorry. Do you want me to just give you a heads up right now about when the first fight is? Yeah, go. On. I'm using the quest helper anyway. Okay, when you when you head towards the docks, when it, when it, like tells you to head towards the dock. The docks. That's when you should probably gear up. Okay. Hang on, am I going the right way for the dark essence? You like, go over here, yes. and there's like a agility something something. Um, I haven't actually done blood runes. I'm only like 61. It's somewhere over here, though, isn't it? And to get the dark essence, you need to go back and use it on the altar. Yeah. I only need one, I think. It's a T480 with a 1080p screen, which people call dim, so if you upgrade anything, it'll be the screen. Is did it? Did you bring a chisel? Shit, did I need a chisel? Oh, there's one on the There's a chisel spot. spawn, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's kind of food. It's explicitly because people kept forgetting it. <laughs> That's cute. Thank you, devs. Do I just need dense runestone? These are both the same, aren't they? Yeah, they're both the same. So is this the AFK part of Bloods? Like you do this and then you t and then you like zoom all the way out and you click on like. I actually don't know how blood rune crafting works. Yeah, it's it's not quite a uh, one click like VMI. But it's it almost a bit more AFK than ZMI, yeah. You like take one shortcut and then you uh you're good to go. So um, it's like you take one shortcut, click on the altar, click back on the shortcut, chisel it, mine another inventory, do that, and then there's like a place where you can just run all the way around and then one more click to the altar. How much uh blood's worth now? Are they under three hundred yet? I think probably I'm not. Right? Check real quick. It made me sad because um my barrows got just so... I made so little from them 
like since the rune crafting thing, the runes you get from Barrows are so sadly, so sadly priced now. Oh yeah, 363, yikes. Alright, Karend Castle, so I'm gonna go to uh, Heart. You have work tomorrow morning, you're going to sleep. Good night, Unicorn, have a nice snooze. Let's game sometime, perhaps. If that's okay. Um, east of Karend Castle. So wait, is, is this the dragon armor looking dude? No, it's not, he's somewhere down here. Here we go. I don't know when I'll do DS2, because I do want to get that bloody um, lo locator orb, <laughs> so I can mobile Nightmare Zone a bit easier. Hope listening to Static is comfy. I'm Martin Holt. What's wrong with the council? What is wrong with the council? They were meant to be temporary. I remember this. So is this meant to be like a reminder of the quest? Of like the Karen stuff? Yeah, AKD is a continuation of all of the House Karen quests. Yeah. Disciples of Yama. Should I read all this or should I hold space? Like, is the dialogue particularly interesting? I mean, if you care about the Karen storyline, yes. I kind of do. No one knows. The council's trying to keep it all down low. Almost like they have something to hide. That's quite the accusation. Ah. They'll slip up sooner or later. They're wanting that to happen. Maybe I'll investigate her escape. What an interesting idea. Um, you're, you're well placed to be a little nosy. Excuse me, sir. I hear the Karend Royal Guard is leading the investigation. Commander whatever is the lady. You'll find her in the castle. Alright, cool. Yeah, like, I didn't spacebar through the, uh, the troll quests, so I found the dialogue in there really good. But then some of the other quests I just, I just didn't care about. They're just not, not interesting. Do you care about the lore of Cook's Assistant? I love the lore of Cook's Assistant. Also, I didn't know you could spacebar through dialogue when I did Cook's Assistant, so I was manually left-clicking click here to continue. So I definitely didn't go through that. I'm Woolhee. Let me guess, you've been looking for Martin Holt. You know him. I know him alright, we have quite the history. He didn't mention it. He wouldn't, he has a very selective memory. He didn't mention he used to work for the council. Oh damn, that didn't come up. His Royal Society friends wouldn't make so much of him if they knew what his loyalties used to lie. You don't agree with his views on the council? Ah, I wouldn't be very good at my job if I did. Martin's always click to point out the failings of the council, but he conveniently forgets all the good they've done. Ah, like? You know the smell in Port Priscillus? It's a bit ripe there. Imagine that, but ten times worse. Oh god. That's what it was like before they had a new sewage system installed. Not only that, but you wouldn't have even stood here. It was under them that trade was established. Without those trade routes, you wouldn't have an easy way of getting here. Okay, fair. Councillor Hughes. That's no secret. The former councillor is dangerous, so I want her back in her cell. I might be able to help you with that. In case you didn't know, I helped catch her in the first place. Did I? I don't remember that. I'm not one of his people, I don't know him, I'm just a willing adventurer. Think about it, however this investigation goes, you'll be se seen as pretty biased towards the council. I'm a neutral third party, I'm in an ideal position to help. You do have experience, and also you smell a bit like Port Priscillus. Let's go, crystal clear, where do we start? I'm heading on over, let's get going. Disappeared. Yeah. I've disappeared. The I'm in a cutscene. Ah. The counselor is the person you arrested during the Queen of Thieves quest. Oh, yeah, I remember. That was a while ago. I did all the work. Hello again, my financially challenged friend. Excuse me? The capture of Sophia Hughes wouldn't have been possible without your contributions. We're conducting an investigation. I like all these like modern 2022 quests with their slightly different uh, speech bubble. Like they put it in the middle of the screen. They've started to be exciting with it. All right, maybe I'll move my. Is there anywhere else I can put my webcam? Like, not really, right? Use it to take up the whole screen. Honestly, like this go. Look at my pause chat. Oh. Alright, sorry. Green screen technology is quite fun. Whoa. Do you like that chat? 
poof, 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 poof. Oh, wait, hang on. Why am I redoing this? Did I miss something up? Join me inside when you're ready. Oh. Holy shit! Oh, thank you, Mr. Bowser. You're welcome. <clears throat> Let's get this started. I guess I clicked on the wrong person there. Let's have a look around this house. Search the house for clues. Show me the magical blue box that will fix finish all the quests for me, please. Ah. Obviously I'd find the receipt in this box. Ah, it's a receipt for a bed at the deeper load. Fen Fentory the 27th. Oh, yes. Oh, a really nice bathtub. Karen's really got it going on, haven't they? Like, magic trees everywhere. Speak with someone they on the ground. They know how to live. They really do, don't they? Like, this area looks really pretty. They've got the bloody cave story, like, red flowers outside. I found something useful. What is it? The counsellor might be hounding, might be hiding out over at Mount Quid. Quid Amortem. That's right. Dosh Wedgie Wongas. This is my investigation. I will handle it. Oh, he goes. Okay. Talk to Fuggy in a pub. All right. I need to go to Fuggy in a pub in Lover Kenji. Where's this? Oh, the pub's right here. That's convenient. There's these flowers everywhere. Aren't they like the king's like flower or something? That's the horse. Mm. It's like his favorite flower. I'm gonna quickly buy. Oh, I don't have any money to buy dragon bitter. How about I sell you one of these dark essence blocks? You can't sell this item. What about this chisel I found? You can't sell this item. You know what? You aren't worth it. Maybe I can pick up. Go to the bank and buy your beer. No, it's okay. I was hoping I could kill one of his dwarves and take their money, but apparently you're not allowed <laughs> to. Hello, what's your pleasure today? Have you had any counsellors here? What do you mean? I'm investigating the disappearance of Sophia Hughes. She rented a bed here. Oh, that's a new one. We don't get many humans here. There was a woman recently who stayed, but she didn't look like a counsellor. She might have been in disguise. You know where she is now? Something about catching a ship at Port Priscillus. Let's go. Piscarillus? Blimey, that was a good one. What in Gillanor was that? It's an earthquake. We get a lot of them. Probably from the volcano, but I'm no expert. Counselor. Ah, here we go. Oh, it even says in the top left, be prepared to fight the Judge of Yammer. The boss uses magic and range. So melee is recommended. Alright. So I'll just go gear up melee and then head over to the port, I suppose. Let's do that. Hey, Lich. You're pondering about the Baba Yaga and her chicken house. If it had a baby, would it be a small house with chicken legs? Often things I think about as well, Lich. I, I can't get such thoughts out of my mind, honestly. How's your, uh, how's your Monday been? By the way, I've, like, barely used this Zami Haster. I, like, bought it. I think I've used it on, like, two tasks. It's not been, it's not been quite the, uh... I mean, it's quite good against dragons. Yeah, but I've just started but... skipping dragons. I mean, if you're not using it, you might as well sell it and keep the cash. Well, the cash doesn't do anything just sitting there, does it? But I think I still need this receipt. What when upgrades you unlock Hydra, do you want? You can make your own claw. What, sorry? <laughs> or make your own, when, you, uh, when you unlock Hydra, you can make your own lance. Yeah, that'd be sick. Oh, I got 91 Slayer today. Grass, oh, grass. nice. So I can kill Cerberus now. Ooh! Doggy doggy. Wait, why do I have so few prayer pods? Oh yeah, I was doing giant mole the other day. Get anything good? Uh, well, he doesn't really drop anything. Actually, no, I did, didn't I? Didn't I get like a dragon spear or something? Oh yeah. Was that from mole. the giant mole? Maybe. Not. Was it from gargoyles? Oh, it might have been from gargoyles. Yeah. No, I don't think the mole dropped yeah. much. He was just a consistent little 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 man. I mean, he drops. Um... The skin and the claws. Which are worth a lot, yeah. Yeah. But I think his like, other loot isn't that valuable. No. Other than the baby mole. Ba yeah, I love the baby. I want the baby mole. Honestly, whenever I yes. see that thing like wandering around the GE, I get so jealous. <laughs> well, I've got a an IRL version of the baby mole. You do. I'm very jealous. Alright, that's, that's fine. 
Um, where am I going? Judge of Yamath. I'm gonna go get that quick plus three prayer boost from my uh, my home because I'm at 67 out of 70. I'm gonna be so upset when I finally get 71 prayer because I've had such a nice like round number. When it finally we'll just have to go to 75. Yeah, it's gonna be upsetting. All right. Or 85 I mean... for diary. 85 for diary. How expensive I is think... that? Uh, bones are a bit up. I haven't done the math. Because bones have not been dropping. Like, the other skilling supplies are quite cheap. Like, it was only 3-something mil for me to go up to, um, 70 construction, 3-something mil to go up to 70 herb law. Oh, nice. Let's get an ash sanctifier okay. and, um... Ah, I've got one, yeah. Just start spapping. I've got... Bone Crusher. Yeah, oh, I love the Bone Crusher. Alright, I'm going to... I'm going to fight the Disciple of... Yammer. Let's go. Disciple of Mifiga Yoma. Where's Veos? Yo, Yoma. I'm looking for a counselor. What do you mean? I want to board the ship. I think I'll just do that. Don't know what this. What I'm expecting. 14 mil for 5k dragon bones, which is enough to bring you from 70 to 85 prayer at the Chaos Altar. Well, that sounds really stressful, though. I did Chaos Altar last time, and it, like. I only got killed, like, a couple times, and I absolutely made more. Like from doing it than not doing it, but like it was still stressful the whole time. You can use my uh, gilded altar if you like. <laughs> Thank you, Tom. All right, they're arguing with each other. What's going on? What girl? Um, cleanse them in a sea of fire and a sea of blood. Judge of Yama, hear my voice. Good lord. Well, I mean, Yama is just like a like an Asian thing, isn't it? That's what the, that Toho character is. Here we go. Uh, hey, Tim. No, I saw Yama is the fire demon that's at the bottom floor of the chasm of fire. Oh, the Yama in, or at least what I know from lore from Toho, which is based on real life, of course. Um, Yama is like a job title. It's, they're like the judge. Hi, Timka. Um, those that oppose you will be judged in the name of Yama. Yeah, there you go. You've betrayed the trust. You've used your generosity to your own advantage. Your life is forfeit. Oh, shit. Serve your master one last time. Good lord. Oh, off she goes. Oh, dude. Vagina demon. Oh, horrifying. Wearing like a dragon torso. The justice has been brought upon Hughes. Holy hot. That's a big old demon. Endangered the life of their children. You can't just show up and start incinerating people. How about you clear clear off? Your guilt will be determined through combat. Ah, oh, should you succeed, you will be free. But should you fail, you will be bathed in fire. I don't want that. Ah, oh, let us begin. All right, dude. Oh, I'm guessing I'm actually want to want to probably dodge these, aren't I? I just... Wait, why am... Oh, I'm burning, aren't I? Okay. Oh, I should probably should have bought a spec weapon. Hey, um... Biker James, I think? Maybe? Thank you for the, the resubscription. It's been a while, huh? Oh, I see what kind of fight this is. Oh! A master of movement in this video game. Slap him in the nose. Oh, that's rude. There's a cool boss fight. There's like hands in like the river sticks or something. My character just decided to walk through that one, huh? Okay. Whatever. Little fire's not gonna scare your character. I, I just, I was just not thinking that's where my pathing was gonna take me, you know? You really do just have to go kind of horizontally, huh? Slap him in the nose. I'm assuming you just have to reach him to stop the fire effect. That's the sort of feeling I'm getting. What, one more hit? One more big, one more big hit? There we go. 
Stinky Dragon. Demon. Cool boss fights are in the third version of the game. Is there a lot of big boss fights in, in RuneScape 3? I could imagine that. They've got quite a big... Um... Oh, thank you, by the way. For this up. They've got uh, quite a budget, haven't they? I haven't really played any RS3, though. Vagineer Mon. Yeah, exactly. On behalf of your council, thank you for dealing with the messy situation. It was nothing. You are mad poggers and a friend of the council. Have you worked out how Hughes escaped? No idea. You've had dealings with Martin Holt and his group. We've met, at least. Well, you've had quite an impact on them. I am quite impactful. That's true. The recent situation's been unfortunate. People are angry. Sophia Hughes has been dealt with. Now it's time for Martin Holt and his protesters to go home. We want me to convince them. That would be nice and poggers. Good luck with Martin. Okay. So what now? We're looking into how Sophia Hughes might have escaped. I'll let you know if we find anything. It's since she turned into a demon and get killed. Is Sophia Hughes the one? She's the other one. Me, me just she south of the, the castle. Demon. Oh, she summoned the demon. And then the demon killed the other person, not the, the person. demon killed her. No, I thought she just got the, killed. She escaped. She, she escaped, and you're trying to track her down. You found her, and then she got killed. But they're trying to find out how she initially escaped. Oh, how she escaped. Okay. Right yeah. There. Councillor Hughes was a deranged cultist, and yeah, I don't know. You don't want to admit it? The man and the girl they spoke of? What did they mean? Ever since the king died, there have been people who questioned his death, like Martin. It was all wild speculation. The king was old and died of an illness. It happens all the time. The man they mentioned could have been the king they were referring to. Maybe it was someone else. The king had a daughter. Rose. She was meant to take the throne after him, but she was too young. His advisors took over until she came of age. The council never made that way, though, did they? She never took the throne. Martin said they'd already declared her mad. Grief can do a lot to someone. Rose and her father were very close. Listen to us, are we really considering this? The council has been successfully ruling it for 20 years now. What happened to Rose? Where did she go? After what happened, public life was no place for her. The council arranged for her to move away. Where is she now? I don't know. I'm the commander of the guard to, for, the, for the council. Surely your duty is to some royalty, not the council. What kind of person would you be if you betrayed them? What about if you followed them blindly when all evidence says no? Oh, I can't. Oh, come on! I can't, but you can. They're like sad runescape faces, dude. He's blamed everything that happened in the port. I have no way of doing anything without him knowing. I'll turn this music like way fucking down. They won't be keeping eye on you. Where do I start? If she's still alive, she's the key to the truth. You have to find her. I know someone who could help. Martin from the society. Oh, yes. Yes, okay, yes. I know it can't be easy for you. Alright, cool. I should go switch back into my graceful, I'm assuming, right? I don't know when. Uh, it seems like there's a lot of talking in the quest tracker. Uh, I believe there's like a tiny bit of combat, but um. Can I just take like a DDS with me? That's what I think I did. Uh, yeah. I need to duck off for a bit. Best of luck on the rest of the quest. Hi, Linux. I might be back later, and we can see if we can do theater of blood or something. Sure thing. See you later. Bye bye. All right, I might start just like skipping through the the text. I don't know. I don't know how much I actually care about it. A lot. A lot, shit. What are you up to, Mr. Bowser? Uh, I'm just doing some fishing. Oh, yeah? Um, I was following you around for a bit, but then you kept teleporting, so... It probably got a bit annoying, yeah? Yeah. Moy. So I'm in the fishing guild fishing for sharks. Yo, you found any good sharks yet? Uh, Not yet, no. Uh, just five regular ones. What's your uh, fishing level? Uh, twenty-eight. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Twenty-eight. Yes. <laughs> Uh, 
Fair enough. Yeah, I quite like fishing. Yeah, it's I like... chill. Yeah, I like doing Tamperos as well. We can do a little Tamperos later if you want. Yeah. I want to get 65 rune crafting at some point so I can oh. get death runes from Guardians of the Rift. We can do... Oh, I was going to say we could do Guardians of the Rift. Do you want to do that before you do Guardians of the Rift again? What do you mean? We could just do Guardians of the Rift as well. If you wanted to get up to 65 a bit more fun. Yeah. Um, I'm just skipping through I, this text. Because <laughs> I uh, completed the Morning's End quests. Oh, yeah. So, oh, congrats, so by the way. Get, I can actually get uh, death, death runes now. Nice. Because I spend a lot of them when I'm bursting against Necreo or Dust Devils. Yeah. Or if I'm using my trident. Hang on, are you crafting your own death runes? Not currently, no, but I'd like to. You so don't just want to get them from some... like, barrows? Uh, I could do, but I sort of want to get my own. That's kind of fun, like a long... training rune craft. Like a bronze man or something. Hmm. Tom Bowser the Iron Man. Yes. When are you starting your ultimate Iron Man account, Tom Bowser? <laughs> Never. I mean, I, I be, I'm tempted to start an Iron, a regular Iron Man, but you're tempted into the, and, yeah. I mean, I spent so much time invested in my main account. Yeah. I don't really want to start all over again on an Iron Man. I just don't want to have to do an awful lot of the things I've already done all over again, but like harder. I know. A lot of the painful quests are a lot more painful as an Iron Man. It's like you can't just buy everything off the GE. Exactly, yeah. You have to go like run across the world to get like a piece of cheese or something. Yeah. I don't know. And then like there's like certain skilling that just sounds horrible, right? Yep. Like if you want to do I mean, like crafting or herb lore, it's impossible. Yeah, part of the thing that made Morning's End 2 so easy was that I didn't have to get the checklist for the dwarf to get the death talisman at the end. Oh yeah, I just bought mine. I, I Yeah, I bought one off the GE, but if I was an Iron Man, I'd have to... You can get, get him as this. a rare drop, can't you? Uh, like a... From Dark Beasts, I think. Yeah. Oh, you need Dark a high Beasts slayer or um, you can get it from... Uh, Guardians of the Rift, which was added recently. Oh, to make it be easier. Yeah, but even so, it'd still be a pain to get it the way it was intended. I could imagine. Hmm. Forthos Dungeon. Oh, that's just next to the Woodcutting Guild, isn't it? I'm just gonna uh, run just there. Just teleport to Zerix Glade. Oh, is it next to the Glade? Yeah. From there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I finally did um the auto weed, by the way. Oh, you went to Thai Farm? Yeah, it took like 40 minutes. It was really easy. You've got to do mm. it. It's like... I thought it was a thing you had to do for each plot. Like, you had mm. to buy an auto weeder or something. Uh, you, yeah. It's one upgrade that costs 50 points. Mm. And it's a permanent thing on every single plot everywhere for it never to grow weeds again. Yeah, and you I mean, I, I wanted to do some Thai farm for the seed box. Yeah, I was thinking about the seed box. Because yeah. uh, when I was training Slayer, I'd get a lot of seeds, and I figured it'd be a good upgrade, but I never got around to I think the seed box it. takes a lot longer. It took me... I think each game's like 22 minutes, and you get 26. If you play it properly, you get like 26 points a, a run. Mm. You get really good farming XP, though, so it's not... Mm. It's Maybe I should do a bit. There. Yeah, it's like 100k or something if you're level 76 farming or something. Mm. Oh, I need an axe. I guess I have to go get all that stuff. I need uh, I guess I should like get all my stuff back now. Axe. I need some death runes. I need a games necklace. I'll, I'll just take a bunch of uh, stamp pots. Here we go. Kingdom Divided indeed is such a spicy quest. Take care, Drew. 
Yeah, I was reading the, the text for a bit and then I started getting tired. <laughs> Um, I like the lore in, uh, in Zaya, but I don't know. I don't want to, I don't want to silently read on my stream because that, that doesn't sound very interesting, but I also don't want to keep talking over and over again because it's tiring. You know, so I'm, uh, I've just started skipping through it. Maybe not for the best. But yeah, Tithe Farm's really easy, Tom. I could, I could mm. show you the guide I found. It's very very easy i mean i've done a little bit of it it's just it was quite intensive it's not so bad you can definitely do it watching youtube if you do one of the less intensive methods like if you only do 20. Hmm. and you don't have to manually click on each um water watering can after the first after you plant everything hmm. so it's, it's actually just left clicking over and over again Okay. E9. Solve the wall puzzle. I don't understand. Oh, is there another... Here we go. E9. R2. S6. O7. Tell me the solution, puzzle holder. What would you want to enter? Oh, obviously 2469, of course. I knew that. I solved that puzzle, of course. Out in a land that's frozen to the bone, a village of statues not made of stone. Oh, they want us to go to Winter Dark. This is like a cool little area, huh? Found anything yet? Yes, another note. I guess we're just following wherever Rose went. Be prepared to find an assassin that finds darts. Talk to Halt in the settlements next to Winterton. Okay. Well, I can just quickly put on some uh, some melee gear. That takes like a second. Dark Souls. Wow! 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 All right, where's this? Uh, where's this assassin at? Is he not not over here somewhere? I haven't really explored around Wintertop much, honestly. Mm. And there isn't an awful lot outside of the the Wintertop camp. Yeah, I guess not. It's like it's like kind of a cool area though. It's like a very wide open, uh, snowy area. Mm. I guess this All quest in more ways than one. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I guess this might be oh, one of the yeah. quests where you actually go and do anything in it. Hmm. These are the wolves that kill everyone's hardcore Iron Man, so they have to give Rune Light another, or they have to give uh, Jagex another five euros or whatever. <laughs> that just sounds stressful, doesn't it? It's like oh, I just bought You're my hardcore. hardcore. Yeah. Oh no, I died ten minutes in. Time to lose another tenner. Hang on, I need to DDS spec you, sir, if that's okay. Oh, Sice Barrage. Oh, hang on, he's just got a reg. Guys, <laughs> I mean. Okay, cast Fire Wave on him. There you go. Be you, Bowser. It's splashed. Oh, he, yeah. He's got a that's regular it. Dragon Dagger. It's not even like a poison one. What a noob. Yeah, right. Crikey, are you need some right? land for the Saradomen wizards. He does, yeah. God, those, yeah, they really get you. Oh, I'm not even wearing my fighter torso. I'm wearing my, uh, my graceful. They're sending some assassins. We don't know if it was the council. Who else would it be? The assassin only named you. Surely the council would only would want me gone as well because they knew what we were doing. Good point. They want to silence you. We don't know that. Martin Holt's having a fucking terrible time. Cast firebolt. I can do that. I'm gonna cast fire blast. Heck off, Death Ring. Hang on, I need to eat this potato. My eye. Oh, it's another, like, panel puzzle. Oh, dearie me. Is this the quest that unlocks, like, the, the quest book that lets you, like, resuscitate animals or whatever? 
It's like the necromancy. Uh, well, I mean, you could always reanimate uh, insult heads before this quest. But you can re you can uh, revive thralls, undead thralls that That's it. support you in battle. And um, but they like haven't you given can us revive the pack crops. Meal. I can already revive crops as part of the base game. Well, um, the Lunar Spellbook allows you to revive crops, but you can also do it on the RCS book, which is quite handy. No, they're, they're two different spells. The uh, the Lunar one is for um, restoring, like, disease, and the RCS one is for restoring it from death. Okay. It's really good if you have, like, a Snapdragon plant that's died, although Tommy says his, like, never fails. Mine have almost always failed, and it's such a pain in the ass going to get the RCS book to just to come over and spend, like, a couple of blood runes and lose them. And you, you don't have much us. luck when it comes to valuable okay. herbs. Apparently not, no. I just gave up and started doing Toad Flex because it's very good profit anyway, and the seeds are, like, two grand each. The seeds are like two oh. grand and I end up with like 200k in a cash stack when I'm finished. Nice. Like herb runs are very efficient. I've been doing some Lantodime recently because I want the XP. I oh. want to get 85 farming to uh, do a master clue. Oh yeah. Well at the very least I need to get 82 so I can boost to 85. You're doing your hardwoods though, right? Yes. Okay. I mean I, w I would... Yeah. I would probably just recommend just doing Renars or Snapdragons or Torstols. Hmm. Um, can I do Torstols? Well, if you can do Torstols. Like, the, money's, the money is really worth it, and you could use the money to buy better farming gear. Like, you could hmm. buy expensive trees or whatever with the profits, and it'll be slightly more efficient. Okay. Like, um, you could do, like, maple trees, I think, are worth a lot, or, like... Just the, uh, you could do Tithe Farm if you really wanted to get that seed box. It's like a hundred. Oh, it's not. What, I don't know what farming level are you? Uh, 81. You could do the hard level one and it's like 100k XP an hour. So you could do that. Do like a couple of runs of that and then do your seed run and a couple of runs of that and then do another seed run. Okay. Snaps and Renars always go in the troll patches and Hasidious. Yeah. You don't plant the good ones that have even a chance of dying. That's, a, that's one way to do it. Martin Holt. Tom and Slo Oh, sorry, are you doing your um, your farming guild uh, contracts? Contracts. Yeah, I've been really doing valuable. them a bit more. Nice. I You're haven't been getting particularly good seeds from them more. yet. But. They're good for other contracts. Like, you end up getting a really banked seed vault. Like, if you mm. need to do any contract, you can get them out of the seed vault in the end. Yeah. I'm at a pub. Is it Oops. illegal to go to the pub now? It, for you it is, I'm afraid. Oh no. Inciting violence, all I've done is express concerns. You've encouraged people to fight us. I've given them a voice. The people who can express their concerns through the proper channels. Now you have to come with us. If I refuse, let's not go there, you know how it ends. Fine, but the people will not stand for this. I will not be responsible for what happens now. Why? I don't know. I made like so much bank, um, like a few, like a, a couple months ago, where um, Snapdragon seeds were staying the same price, but the herb was going really expensive from like Nex or something. All right. So I had like a tr I had like so many seeds banked, and buying the new ones were really cheap as well. Hmm. But um. I don't know. It was it was it was nice. It was a nice time to be a farmer. Good. Uh, it's fairy ring CIR. I'm quite a, quite a snoozy boy, I'm afraid. Long day at work. No, not really. I looked at my phone at some point. It was like quarter past three, and I was like, oh. <laughs> like that was it's quite a quick day, I guess. Hmm. Um, I'm just tired. I, know, I guess I was. Of RuneScape on the train home. Uh, yeah, I was. I uh, I'm doing my my skill and grinds. So I was. I was just making potions. That's all. Nice. Let me in. I want to do um bloody 
Chin Chompers at some point. And I might also be tired because my weekend was about being ill as well, maybe. Oh, yeah. It's also like, I don't know, 20 to 10. I've been up since like 6 or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Long, long talky day. Oh, we've we found. Uh... Can you hear me? What the heck? That doesn't look threatening. You don't look threatening. Man, who are you? I could ask you the same question. This is private. You're not welcome here. <laughs> well, here's the thing. I don't actually care. Woolly he. Wow, wow, wow. I came here looking for someone. I think it's this person. I think they're in a lot of trouble. I think you're in a lot of trouble. Who are you? My heck. You're looking for Rose, aren't you? Is this her? Yeah. And who are you? I'm Councillor Liam Orson. Please, you'll have to understand. Why are you doing here with Karen's missing princess? And why is she lying there like that? You have to explain everything quite quickly. I don't know where to begin. What about her father? How did she die? There was something wrong with him. You expect me to believe that? It's the truth. He was always a fan of antiques. One day he bought an old flask from Lovakenji. He began drinking from it whenever he went and started to change him. The flask was cursed with a dark magic. He stopped being himself and started saying things he would do to the citizens. We did what we had to. So you killed him and took over his throne. We didn't want the throne. It was meant for Rose. That clearly didn't happen. She was never meant to be involved. We were going to look after things until she was ready, but she found out what we did. So you did this to her. We didn't mean to hurt her, but we couldn't risk her telling anyone. This is the only way. Well, you failed. She got the word out. It took 20 years, but thanks to her, your rule is at the end. What happens now? That's not for me to decide. There's someone who needs to see this. Oh, damn. It's all its all coming to a... To a... To a story point. She's not aware of anything. Doesn't look like it. What a mess. What of the counsellor? Where is he? I locked him in a different room. I didn't want him running off. Apparently I locked a guy up, huh? You can come out now. Counselor? Commander? Tell me this isn't true. I defended all of you, so you've been lying. Oh, we did it for the people. Don't give me that. Look what you did to her. She was a child, Liam. I'm sorry. What did you do? We gave her a magic potion. It was a mage. It was an Arceus mage. He was an expert in curses, and he realized what was happening, so he gave us a poison for the king. That would have been nice to mention earlier. Who was this mage? He never told us his name. So you trusted him? Everything he said was true. The king was cursed and we could see it. Did it ever cross your mind that maybe the mage was the one who cursed him in the first place? How do you know he wasn't just using you? Of course it crossed our minds, but we didn't have a choice. The king was deteriorating by an hour. By the hour. You could have gone to Lord Arceus. You could have gone to Shazian. You could have gone to anyone apart from some random mage. Have you met him since? Yes. Rose's condition has no cure, but it can be kept in check with regular treatment. He meets with me and gives me the potions she needs. How do you know it's not the potions that are doing this to her? I've done my research. They're safe and she can't live without them. Who is it? We read next to Mulch. He lives in the temple with the lizardmen. We need to find out who he is. I'll go there and I'll find him. Oh, heck. The lizard dwelling. There's so many things going on in this quest, man. It's quite different to the bloody drunken tale of the drunken dwarf. <laughs> where, like, I went on, like, some rails for, like, ten minutes, and then I got very drunk and told everyone about my favourite kebabs or something, and that was the, that was the quest. I mean, that, that's what happens in real life. No, it is. Late. I didn't really like that quest, though, because it makes you wait twice. It makes you, like, grow hops and then, like, brew beer. Oh yeah. I really don't like the shoehorned farming in some quests. I find it kind of frustrating. Like some quests are like you grow the thing and it's like instant and it's like, oh nice. And then some of them you have to wait like ten days to finish the quest and it's like, oh. Isn't there's That's like a big moy moment. There's a big moment, yeah. Well there's the um <sighs> What's that quest called? I don't remember. My brain's disappeared. But you need it for enlightened journey or I don't know. It's like the Varrock, Varrock quest with like the King's Garden or whatever. Oh, um, the Garden one. Garden of Tranquility, yeah. Yep. 
This is not southeast of the Farming Guild. Oh, wait, hang on. Farming Guild is not where I'm looking for, is it? Good lord, I've gone so... So out of my way. Well, let me actually just go to the Farming Guild instead. I, I went to um, Persidious thinking, oh, you're farming. Like an idiot. Imagine if the Farming Guild was actually where the, you know, the farming stuff was going on. <laughs> That'd be quite useful. It does seem a little out of place at like the foot of a giant ass mountain, doesn't it? Yeah. Or guilds are in the right place. Fishing. I think the woodcutting guilds in an alright spot. Mining guilds in a very sensible place. Yeah. But like, you, you go outside of the farming guild, and then there's suddenly like a bloody pyramid like an There's aztec a volcano, which probably has oh. fertile soil that make yeah that's that makes some sense i guess but you you go between this like crazy banjo kazooie music where it's like do 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 and then you go into like a lizard temple where everyone's green and dying and freakfish 99 and friends are here I actually really like the music in the Lizardman Temple. I did I did uh, hang out a bit here once for a uh, diary. Oh yeah. You need to kill like one uh, shaman. I was thinking, man, that was tough. Imagine having to kill like 200,000 of them. 5,000 to get the Warhammer. Well, that's what that's on drop rate, right? Yeah. Why are there so many people called Freakfish99? Are they gambling well, bots? Oh no, it might be the same one, but he entered through a better door <laughs> than me. Oh, the shark! It's a it's a lizardman shaman. Can you help me find a mage? Do you mean your Karl Ark? Your Karl Ark? It's the name we use for the mage that guides us. He has a name. Where did he come from? He's been here since our master still walked among us. He was sealed away, but they released him before he could guide us. I need to see him. See the door? It leads to his lair. You don't call someone's bedroom a lair, do you? You're like a you're like a you mother. All the gaming. You don't have a, a woolen lair. No, I don't. I have a I have the the bedroom. I guess. <laughs> Can I have your key? Why should I help you? I could just kill you instead. I could shout for help. Humans are not meant to be in the temple. Do you think you could survive us all? What do you want in return? A trade? The mage. He sends us to fight the humans. He says we must do it for our master, but he's long gone. I'm done with fighting. I want to serve our master in other ways. I could help you escape. I'm a shaman, I don't need help from humans. What then? The hatching area in the swamp to the southwest, my last egg is there. If I go and it stays, it will die in this war. If I bring you this egg, you will give me the key. Yes. Okay. Cool. Like, the lizardman area is really cool. But I think you basically <clears throat> have no reason to be here as a main account, right? Although I think lizardman shamans... If you want to get shamans... your own dragon warhammer, then... They're not. And I think, I think the shamans have decent drops as well. They're not terrible money now, yeah. I guess if you get them on a slayer task, you can wear a slayer helm. Hmm. Yeah, I disabled the lizardman task. Oh, you bought it? I bought it and then disabled it. So. <laughs> Moi. Well, it's like how I originally blocked, like, hellhounds and blood veils and all sorts of stuff, and then I ended up, um... Yeah, I mean, Hellhounds are great for hard clues. Yeah. And they're decent XP, but not much else. And then Bloodfells are great XP. Especially if you're killing them in the catacombs. Which ones in the catacombs? Like, the muta the mutilated ones or whatever? The mutated ones, yeah. Are those actually worth it? They have better drops in the regular Bloodfells, and um, they have great HP and low defense, so you can get a lot of XP from them. Oh, I've just been killing the burstable, or not the burstable, the um, cannibal ones. You come for I mean, I think the Slayer task would be fun. Like, if you do get a hammer, that's 50 mil. Yeah. And if you ever want to do bossing, then it's very useful. Maybe oh, I've been trying to kill the Chaos Elemental a bit. I want to get the pet, it's apparently 1 in 300 chance. From the Lizardman? Uh, the Chaos Elemental. Oh, yeah, it's a really cool pet. Oh, yeah, on. it's in very deep wilderness, so you have to be careful of PKs. 
Yeah, but you can take, yes. like, all you take is, like, a bunch of stews and stuff, right? Well, yeah, you take a full inventory of curries. Or curry, yeah. Um, and then I bring my Bandos God Sword so I can lower its defense. Oh, yeah. And then um, keep Black Dragon Hide armor. And then I'll what do you beat kill it, it with? to death. With the BGS? The, with the God Sword, yeah. I only bring three particularly valuable items, so and two of them if I do get killed. Anyway. Yeah, if I get killed, then I don't lose too much. How much is the BGS? 8 mil? About and mil? 15 mil. 15 still? Yeah. So for a god sword, it's quite good value. I guess so. Um, and it the special attack lowers defense. That's quite useful. So if you do have some spare cash and you want a, a better weapon, then consider a, a god sword. Yeah. Here is the key. Isn't there a, a new god sword that's really cheap? Which is like 9 mil. Uh, the Zamorak god sword is very yeah. cheap. That's like 4 mil. Oh, it's 4. Um, I think the Armadil god sword is quite cheap as well. That's oh, only AGS. like 10. But AGS has a really good spec on it, doesn't it? Oh. It's just a really uh, powerful attack. Oh, yeah. It, it's like 37. 0.5% extra damage or something like that. Oh, damn. So there's no extra effects, it's just a a beat stick, effectively. Do you reckon I can kill this boss with, like, my random BS? I have, like, some sharks and some gear. That's probably fine. I'd recommend getting range gear for him. Have you done this fight? Yes, I found it a lot easier if you use a, blow, a blowpipe. Alright, I'll do that then. I suggest doing some research on this boss, because... He has various attacks that can deal a lot of damage if you're not prepared. Um, well, let's see first. I'll, t I'll take your advice of the blowpipe. Because he says various uh, messages when he does various attacks, so uh, it'd be useful to be prepared for oh, the I'll attack. Give a, I'll give it a quick look up then, yeah. It's the first time I tried with melee and I found it really difficult. Oh yeah. And then the second time when I tried with the blow top blow pipe, it was a lot easier. Okay. Um, what did I need to get to him? The uh, skills necklace, right? Uh, yes. Um... Okay, I'll give him a quick Google then. It's recommended to read or watch a guide on the fight. Alright. Xanfer. Xanfer. Um... He uses attacks with grasp spells which bind the player if damage is taken. Praying Protect from Magic will greatly reduce damage taken. He uses Protect from Magic himself. The fight begins with some marks on the ground. Walking over is bad. Don't walk over the ground. Okay. He summons some Phantom Hands with low hit points. When they deal any damage, they have a chance to cause corruption that drains prayer points. So you want to kill the hands. Okay. He summons Ghostly Hands that come crushing down on the player... The on the tile the player is stood on every game tick. You avoid them by walking or running around the room while avoiding marks of darkness until the attack stops. It's possible to run back and forth to avoid damage like the fireballs and Vorka. Okay. And then there's some history information on him. This uh, wiki page is not very specific on him. I mean, yeah, just, just when he around, attacks, honestly. keep moving and avoid the Avoid the, the marks on the ground. I guess I can just attack him after the... Uh, well, the punches. advantage of using range is that you can attack him from pretty much anywhere. Yeah. Whereas melee, you have to be next to him, and I think he has better melee defense. His range defense is really bad, so you can deal more damage with her. Hello, Raph. Uh, Android. Hello! Oh yeah, Android. I forget, yeah. Sorry, I keep saying Wrath. You know it's like permanently installed in my memory of having called you Wrath for like two years. I will try my best to, to remember. 
you just want to be called like android or or whatever you prefer i'm doing okay thank you i was a little poorly last week but i'm, I'm feeling better now how are you it's nice to see you all right southeast of the farming guild am i fighting him i'm fighting him in like his house aren't i wait i don't need yep. like anti-poison or anything do i uh, I don't think he can poison, no. Okay, I might get poison on the way in, that would suck. I try my best though, Rath. <laughs> you, you know, you know I'm, not, I'm not being, I'm not trying to take the piss. I am, I am trying my best, but it's, yeah. Yeah, I'm doing alright now, I think. I'm not, I'm not taking anything too, uh, too harshly. I think I did some good streams last week though. We did like an MS Paint stream, we did the, the Toho stream. Um, I really love Vermintide. We need to play more when Chris is back. It's so much fun. So I want Protect from uh, Magic, don't I? Yes. You... Yes. Okay. You got off from doing your first stream in almost a year, it was fun. Oh nice. What were you playing? Like a Nia game or, or something? Uh, I meant I thought I'd get a few more steps to drink my stamina potion, but that's fine. I saw this big corridor and I was like, ah, oh, I guess I'll be walking down there. You hear a conversation in the next room. I was actually quite surprised. I thought you of all people would have made more of an effort to find me. Your greatest achievement was my downfall. The lizardman blamed your, you for your disappearance and sealed me away. I was trapped for centuries. Yet here you are. I convinced the shamans that I was on their side. They've let me free. You were beaten by a treasure hunter. With humble respect, there are not one to thank. It was me. I worked out how to find you. I planted the seeds that led him to you. A proxy. I wouldn't have thought you'd be one to hide away. The world has changed. Working from shadows has shared me, served me well. The earthquake was a considerable amount of dark energy, something I couldn't ignore, but to what end? The same end as always. Quidam Mortem has been lost to us, but there are other ways to harness the dark altar. And see, what of this council that now rules Karend? I sense your work at play there. I needed access to the altar, they were a means to an end. You installed a puppet rulers just to access the altar? My, my, Zampha, you haven't lost your ambition. Never, my lord. I also hoped to access Karend would have future uses, but I fear the council is done. You're probably right. Karend is of limited use to us, eh? The kingdom was always a means to an end, a disappointing necessity while we were still shackled. Wow, it's the RuneScape devs writing in their own feelings into the quest. People wanted new content, but for it to still be old school styled, so we spent an insane amount of time and effort building this area and no one liked it. Oh, wait. He played Abzu! Nice! I remember watching bits of Abzu. Moi. I know, like, some of the areas in Karend are so unbelievably, like, pretty. Like, they've clearly put so much effort into making it look good, and then there's no content there, and everyone, like, ignores it because it's big. Mm. It's such a shame. Like, Shazian's such a pretty area. Little time will be of little meaning to it. It does always feel like I'm playing a different game when I'm here. I don't know what it is, but there's some, like, feeling. There's, like, a general, like, aura here. I don't know what it mm. is. It was apparently really bad on launch. It was like three times bigger, completely flat and empty and had nothing in it. And there was like vast expanses of nothing between every area. But now everything's a bit more compact and like not just a square and there's teleports everywhere. I mean, with time, they can put extra content in it and flesh it out a bit. I hope they do. I would have liked to do the first leagues that had uh, Veos. It's Veos? Dude. What the heck? I would have uh, liked to do the first leagues that was mm. only in uh, Karenda. I feel like that would have been really fun. Like, there's so many cool, unique skilling areas for like the early mid-game. Yeah, I just you have no reason to go here. Because in the early mid-game, you have no way of getting around, so it's really tedious. Mm. I think I took a wrong turn somewhere. I'll go now. I don't think so. You've heard too much. You've seen too much. You won't be going anywhere. This boss is creepy. How about you tell me what in the Gilanor is going on here? You think this is the part where I tell you everything? No, this is the part where you die. Uh-oh. Spooky boss fight, dude. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. I don't really know what I'm doing. Yeah, attack from magic. Ah, oh, that's it.
Oh, is it every tick I want to move a little bit? If the hands are coming down on you, yeah, you need yeah, to keep moving. Oh, is this other hit just his normal hit? I do have a bit of a delay, so I'm not sure what you're talking about. It's just a regular hand, like, every second. I think the hands are purple if they come keep coming down on you. Oh, so this is just his normal That's hit, like, then? Yeah. Oh, your, your Doom approaches must be the hand, right? Oh, it's spooky, man. Yeah, I guess this is just his normal hit then, yeah. God, this would be pain with melee, you're completely right. It's probably a very good thing that I went back and respect, honestly. I was like wondering if I could just pop in here and just like quickly tap 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 him. I don't know how you're meant to like turn around a corner like tick perfectly though you know like I feel like I get hit every time I like stand at the end mm. oh fuck I just walked over a fucking stop walking over the shadow lands dude don't stand oh you know what well, whatever I have 50,000 shots I call boss fight. Nice. Oh no, there's more of him. Oh my god, there's another stage. No, no, no. Unless. Hey, Burgatora. You're gonna be streaming a few more games. You have some indie games lined up as well. Oh, cool. What are we supposed to be doing? The Yorko Alk wants this corpse moving. Are you sure it's dead? It looks dead. Ugh. It's a zombie. Let's get out of here. Damn. They don't run away with any hurry, do they? Don't much. Yeah, oh, we can walk away from it slowly. Yeah. Fine. Oh, I didn't like the camera placing that like twitching hand right in front of my face. It's creepy. It's like I'm being head pat the streamer. Donut County is amazing, Ref. Let me know how you enjoy it. Did I play? I think I played it with Chris, didn't I? It was really fun. They decide to give a book a quick read. Um, I place a device next to the altar. There's ascended humans in Arceus. I will soon realize something is amiss. Old Shazy in general buried near the battlefront. His grave is nice and remote. No one will miss him if he goes for a little walk. Oh dear. Okay. Well, let's go back to the GE. Oh, you've 100% completed Donut County. Nice. It's a good game, isn't it? Ah, I just eat that last shark. That's okay. Sharks are a lot cheaper than I always think they are. Like, they're still kind of expensive, <clears throat> but like... They're less than a thousand Considering they're... Each. Yeah, they're good healing. They're really good healing. Yeah. Dum, bum, bum, bum. I used to make tuna potatoes for my clan members back in the day. That's cute. For the, for the best healing. Are they better than sharks? or? Yeah, they heal 22 as opposed to 20. So Why do I never see anyone better. using them? Uh, they're tedious to make. Oh. Uh, they require a lot of steps to make. So oh, that ex that for two extra funny. HP, they're not particularly worth it, I guess. Or well, the shark and is especially just when you. And now manta rays exist. Oh, and you and I get think those. they heal. They heal twenty-two as well, and they're a lot less hassle to make. Two potatoes are super tedious. Oh, fair enough then. But when I was paid two k each to make them, it was well worth it. It was worthwhile. That's cute. And I, and I couldn't fish sharks at the time, so I like. I really like that. Like a nice old, a nice old-fashioned MMO. Everyone has their own little place. Yeah. I mean, RuneScape was my life back as a teenager. It was great. 
Oh yeah. Wait, what age were you playing Team Fortress? Um, well, I got it on. I got the orange box on as one of my first games for the Xbox yeah. 360. Um, I was 15 when I got my Xbox. Oh yeah. So I played Team Fortress on the Xbox until I was 18. Then I got my first laptop. Oh yeah. And um, played it on computer instead. Um, so yeah, been playing it for about 10, 13 years. Oh. I, I don't really play that much anymore, but it's an old yeah, been playing. I've been playing Team Fortress since probably about 2008, I think. Hot damn, Tom Bowser. Also, I can't believe Veos was, uh, they brought back Veos for the quest line. I know. He's mm. secretly evil. I can't believe the man that was clearly evil was secretly evil. <laughs> Zanfo worked with Andrews to manipulate the other councillors into killing the king. Councillor Andrews was in from the start. He always wanted the throne. Zanfo offered him in return for the access to the Dark Altar. Why? He'd been redirecting power from the altar, but I don't know why. His work is what caused the recent issues in Arceus. What else has he been responsible for? But first, what did we do with Rose? I did some research. Liam wasn't lying. The poison has irreversibly destroyed her mind. There's no cure. I doubt Zampho won't be making any more potions anytime soon. Maybe Arceus can help. Someone could make the potions, but all they do is prolong her suffering. What are you saying? Oh shit. This is no life for anyone. The truth is, Rose died long ago. All that's left now is an empty shell. Oh damn. A little bit of a... Uh... Ah. Not really what I thought was going to happen with that. Hi, Adrian. Oh, how sad. Back when I was a girl, there was this Shazian patrol that would go past our house every morning. Every day I would run out and wave at them as they ran by. For as long as I can remember, I always wanted to join the army. Become a farmer or chef, my parents would say. The army isn't for you. But I knew what I wanted, and I knew nothing would stop me from getting it. I saw some nasty things while serving the council. I'd always tell myself it was necessary. Whatever I thought about giving up, I'd ask myself who I'd be replaced with. Even if things weren't perfect, I was in the best place to improve them. It was a lie though, wasn't it? It's always been a lie. I've spent most of my life serving a bunch of murderers, turning away from the truth because I was scared of being wrong. To think it was Martin who was right all along. We can still make it right, we can still stop the council. We won't be able to do it alone. The council still holds the power in Karend. I'm not sure if that's true. The real power is held by the five houses of Karend. Together they could replace the council and take over the kingdom. We'd need them all to get on board. Leave that with me. Alright, you gather the five leaders. Convince them to meet us at Zerik's lookout, southeast of Shazian. That's where I left the councillor. We won't be disturbed there. Consider it done. Feels wrong her being out here. She's to have had a proper funeral. It's not so bad, it's peaceful, and she's free from the drama of Karend. Suppose you're right. We'd best get going. Goodbye. Oh, what, like a forlorn little little set piece? RuneScape looks cool, but you don't think you'd have the mental fortitude to grind through it and keep clicking the same object to attack a bunch of times while standing in place. Your gamer brain likes movement. Don't worry, Rathalos. This game doesn't this game doesn't hook onto your mental fortitude to attack a bunch of times. It hooks into your mental fortitude of your, the uh, reward center of your monkey brain that tells you that number going big and big fireworks is fun and exciting, and that's what you want. What happened to all my sharks? Oh, I dumped them. I, I ate them all. You did a classic Bowser. I raided your bank and ate all the sharks. <sighs> I knew it. They're my sharks now. I don't know, the game's fun. There's a lot of quests and there's a lot of stuff you can do. Like, I have several hours a day I need to spend commuting and it makes me feel like I'm doing something. Obviously, I'm not actually doing anything. But seeing these numbers slowly go up is it's like, I'm, it's like I'm doing something with this otherwise completely wasted time. That's why you play Final Fantasy. I need to start playing that again. Tommy, Tommy really wants, I'm sure. Within the deepest souls of his soul. 
Tomu and Kate wanted me to play uh, FF again. Because I did enjoy it when I was playing it. You know? I, I thought it was a really good game. And apparently, like, the part of the game I'm in is still completely free, so I could just pick it up. I might have to, like, pay money to change servers or something. Because they've all decided to change. The thing with Final Fantasy, though, is it, it doesn't have a mobile version, does it? Like, you're not going to play Final Fantasy on the bus, are you? It's very addictive once you get the hang of it. Well, I only did a couple streams of it, so I guess I didn't really get to that part yet. But I just enjoyed the, the world. I thought it was pretty, and the music was nice. And the weird people ERPing on the, the sky bridge was weird. I've just not played any massive, massive MMOs, just this really. Hello, there's something I need your help with. What is it? We need it in private. It involves the current council and connected to our death here. I'll come at once. Where do we meet? Zerix Lookout. Very well. Oh, is he the leader? Yeah, thank you. I guess this is because I'm like friends with everyone, right? They're all listening to me. Mm. I'm like a hundred uh, favor or whatever. There's a mobile app where you can shop for stuff and check player profiles. But it's more this like when I play RuneScape, there's like two very different parts of the game. There's like stuff like this quest where it's like I'm actively playing the game and this is the thing I'm looking at. And then there's the grindy bit where you're actually just watching TV and fishing in the background. It's very nice for that. Like a lot of the time I'm not playing RuneScape. I'm not actually looking at it. I'm usually watching YouTube or something. So it's really good. If you ever need a game to like play while you're doing something else, this is like perfect for it. Go to Zerik's Lookout. I can't just go running off for no reason. It's about the council. Ah, the day has come. What do you mean? They've been discontent with this council ever since the day they took control of the kingdom. There was always going to come to head. That point has arrived. I will go. Thank you. Hey, Lily. Yeah, you can fish in the toilet. Isn't RuneScape on Twitch? Is, is RuneScape on Switch or are you tripping? You might be tripping. I don't know, is it? I don't think it's on Switch, is it? Maybe it is. I, I think was... it's on the Switch. It's on Linux, so if you mod your Switch to run Linux, you could put RuneScape on it. It's just really nice because it's, you know, when you're watching TV, sometimes you feel a bit of a slog. So then you pull out your phone and you've got nothing to do and you're like, oh, well, you know, we could just quickly get like a few mining levels or something. It's kind of nice. It's all the stuff you don't want to actually have to do, but it's functionally zero time because you're always doing something else. Hello, human. I need you to join me at Xerix Lookout. This quest feels like kind of epic, doesn't it? Like it's building up to like something, or it's like quite a big, big stakes quest. Something urgent. Yeah. It feels like very it's, serious. It's uh, um, penultimate Marvel Avengers, right? Um, quest. It unifies all the various current quests. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hang on. How do I recharge my my memoirs? Do I need to get like some? Um, memoirs being to get, like, some, some runes. runes and... Let me look into that. Well, how do I spell it? Cards memoirs. Recharging. You need a law, body, mind, and soul. Mind, body, soul. Do I have any soul? I have some soul runes. Um, Xerix Lookout, northeast of it. Okay. So, Xerix Lookout. Hopefully, you can't hear my dogs barking. Is that where your legs are tired? Hmm? <laughs> your legs are tired. Isn't that the saying, like, oh, my dogs are barking? Well, I'm not familiar with that saying. It just... <sighs> my dogs are barking. My dogs are barking is a phrase to say my feet hurt. <laughs> you not heard that? No, that's the first time I've heard that phrase. Chat, don't tell me I'm crazy. That's definitely a thing, right? The anus is the soul of the body. All right, Kappa. Oh, you did also post a Kappa. Interesting. Add 40- I can have 40 charges? Since when? 
Is it because I did some, like, um, achievement diary since I was last here? I have, like, the hard diary. Oh, you on me. Hard. Nice. It's really nice. The, um, I wish I'd done it way sooner, because I, I can go to, um, the Yeah, the, Slayer. the Radder's Blessing is quite useful. Well, I can go to the, uh, Slayer Master, like, one click, so it's really nice. Nice. I'm usually going to the Gem Mine one, but it's still Your handy. Your Slayer is a bit low. It's only, like, 70 or something, is it? 78. Need to go up to 85 so you can get your own Abyssal Whips. Yeah. You've never heard of my dogs are barking? My dogs are barking is not a rare phrase. That's like a... That's a very common phrase, isn't it? You have an early lecture tomorrow. It starts in 12 hours. How is that early, dude? That's, that's like, it's like 10 o'clock in the morning, isn't it? It's quite a late, isn't it? It's British. Tom Bowser's British. And I'm older than you, and I've never come across that phrase. You seem like this exact sort of person that would say my dogs are barking. Well, who are like the hobbits at the uh, start of the first Lord of the Rings film? The long I say my dogs are barking when my dogs are barking, not when my feet are hurting. But, but you, you remember like the long feet, the the big toes, like all the, the hobbit families at the start in the Shire, and they're all like holding their feet up in the air. They're the sort of people that would say my dogs are barking. You've never what, heard it. What, Cockney slang or something? It's, it's not... I'm going to Google this. My dogs... My dogs are barking. Uh, is there like an origin somewhere? Apparently it's an American idiom. Is that right? I can't be right. My dogs are barking origin. It can be traced to some journalist for the New York Evening Journal. Maybe I watch more American TV than you. Are you secretly an American? <clears throat> Sorry. Oh my god. Streamer is not clinically insane. Oh my god. I thought you'd have to dealt with that. I'd prefer to have done it without demons being involved. Idiots will be idiots. Tell them about the latest council nonsense. We need to be more private. Sorry, is my secret hideout in the sewers not private enough for you? Not really. Meet me at Zerik's lookout. If you waste my time, you'll regret it. Alright. I'm not a valley girl. Oh my god. Don't liken me to those people. Alright? I'm like my own person. Okay? Got my own rich, depthful history. Don't forget it. Streamer is not clinically wool he he either. Most of your lectures have been at one fifteen. I, I waste. I thought you were about to say you have a you have a thing at like fucking six a.m. or something, and that you have to go now. In what world? In what world? You just wanted to write iOS to imply Android, but you're not sure that would be too understandable. Oh, I see. I see. Inverted iOS. Very good. Hello. There's something urgent I need your help with. What is it? Wait, hang on. Who was the other guy we got? Was he not Shazian? It involves the council. Come to the, the lookout. Alone? It's an unusual request, but yes, please. Look, Lorenz at stake. Oh, hang on, who was the other guy that I just got? Was he not... Chazian? He must have been the Persidious guy, I guess. He must have been. Yeah. I'm not speaking American, alright? I'm just speaking my mind. Of which there is little left. Well, you did it. It's been a while since I've seen the leaders together. They're downstairs waiting. Is the councillor there? Yes, I told him about Rose. How did he take it? How do you think? Keep a close eye on, close eye on him. Let's go down. We did kill her. Quite the group you've gathered here. Yes, it's for a very good reason. Liam? My lords and ladies, there is something you must be aware of. Regarding myself and my fellow councillors, we... I can't. 
Yes, you can, Liam, and you will. Don't lecture me. You have no right. You killed her. What's going on? Who did you kill? They called me a murderer, but they killed Rose. I kept her safe. You killed Rose 20 years ago. Stop hiding and accept the truth. Is iOS built on Android? They're completely different. They're completely different. iOS is something built in-house by Apple. They might both be distantly Unix derived. So they, they have a common ancestry. But iOS was built in-house by some extremely smart people in private by like the best people at Apple in like 2005, 6, something. It might even be longer than that. You speak of the king's daughter, what's happened? This coward killed her, just like he killed her father. We did it for the good of the kingdom. You did it for yourselves. The king was cursed. The king was cursed so you had an excuse to kill him. It was never about the throne, it was about the throne. Wait, what? Never about the people. I've seen proof with my own eyes. If you think otherwise, then you've been fooled as well. Stop arguing and give us an explanation. Andrews plotted to kill the king with a mage called Xanfa. Xanfa cursed the king so that Andrews had an argument to get the others on board. And then they killed him. Yes, and Rose. Rose overheard us. Do you think she just happened to overhear you? No doubt the councillor arranged for that to happen as well. So it's true, I always knew the council was corrupt, and now we have proof. What do we do with the proof? That's why I've gathered you here. The council needs to be removed from power. You five can make it happen. They will also have to be replaced. Who should replace them? Is there another member of the royal family out there? I doubt it. The council's plan only worked because Rose was the king's only heir. Do you want us to go back to a king? The democracy of the council were the false, but democracy is still the answer. Let the people decide. Since when did Lady... Priscodarius care for the people. Last time I checked, your citizens lived in constant squalor. Don't lecture me, you warmongering fool. I've done more for the kingdom than you'll ever know. Well, if you do care for your people, surely a monarch is perfect. They're crying out for one right now. The royalists do have a lot of support at the moment, but who would the monarch be? I have an answer for that. Wool and sleeplet. Oh, wool hee hee. The royal <laughs> accord of twill. What is that? The Royal Accord of Twill is the answer to our issue. Once in a great time... I like that he walked up and placed it on the table. That was cool. Like, really minor thing. Once in a time of great need, the five houses took control of the kingdom. Now it falls to us to do it again. It's time for a new accord. You'd see us rule together? In a way, we'd all be responsible for Karen, but in an individual way. A new accord to require all five of us to agree on the contents. Then thinking you're getting me to sign it, I'll have no part in this. You've been silent on this, Leverkenj. What are your thoughts? I don't understand. The council rule over Karend. We can't just take over. We have to. There's no other option. Goodness, I think I need a sherry. Nice. A break might be beneficial for all of us. We have a lot to consider. Let's reconvene later. RuneScape does have a story, yeah. But it's lots and lots and lots and lots of separate stories. There's like a couple of main overarching quest sidelines. There's like the vampire quest, there's this Karend quest, there's like the, uh, the troll quest, there's the dragon slayer quest, and there's like a bunch of separate lines. Some of them like intertwine a bit. What do we do now? The Royal Accord seems like our best bet. A clear document. Like, the point of RuneScape is that there's no, like, main story. You know, you can go do whatever you want. Um, a clear document signed by all of them that determines the future. Kind of like an anthology. Yeah, lots and lots and lots of separate stories written by a lot of different developers over, like, 20 years or whatever. Sometimes you get Monkey Madness, and sometimes you get Dragon Bone Man 2. <laughs> They're all very, very varying. It's not going to be easy. No, but there must be a way. They all seem to have some level of trust in you. Maybe you can convince them. I'll give it a go. They could quickly get interesting, but if you do need... But you need to do whatever it takes to get them back at the table. If one of them walks away, we have a big problem. I'll go talk to all of them. Good luck. Alright. Look, I can show you my uh, quest list. Um, so this is like all the base quests in the game. There's like 289 of them. 
Or 289 quest points. There's 250 quests. And there's a bunch of free ones as well. I mean, there's all the desert quests as well. That's its own thing. But then you can, like, filter them further. This is, like, a new thing they've added. So you could filter it by storyline. There's Camelot, Demon Slayer, Dorgishkun. Oh, yeah. Dragonkin, Elemental, Elf. Elf, Elf one's really long. Fremnik, Gnome. These are all, like, different storylines. And then these are all, like, separate stories. So there's a, there's a lot of stuff. And those are just, like, quests. There's obviously, like, a ton of stuff that isn't in quests. Like, it's quite a big map. There's loads of stuff that isn't linked to quests whatsoever, and it's just its own content. Like, this is a mini game, and... There's a lot. There's a lot going on. There's, like, raids over here. Oh, this is Quidamorton. Okay. Anyway. Hello. I was hoping you'd speak to me. There's much we need to discuss. About the council? No, not really. The revelation is concerning and needs to be addressed, but I have a much bigger fear. Last time we spoke, he said this had a connection to the death in Arceus. Does it have anything to do with the mage you mentioned? Yes. Zampho was his name. I discovered his hideout in the Lizardman Temple under Mulch. He was responsible for the device that was redirecting power from the altar, but I'm not sure what the power was for. The earthquake was involved. Did he look like an Arceus citizen? Yes, how did you know that? It's not a common name, but it's one I've heard. During the strife, Age of Strife, Zeric was assisted by a loyal servant of the same name. You don't think it's the same person, do you? Once we would never have considered it, but a recent discovery you made means it's very possible. The altar is at Quidda Mortem. Thanks to the altar, Zeric and his followers had access to the same power that keeps every citizen of Arceus alive. With the power, they might have lived much longer than originally believed. It's possible one of them lives to the day. Something else as well. The other person was Veos. The weird thing is, Zampha spoke as if Veos was his master. This isn't the first odd occurrence when it comes to Veos. A while back, I helped him with a strange client of his. When we were done, the client spoke through Veos. He said some strange things. Interesting and concerning. Maybe the client is the one he considers his master. What if Veos' client is Zampha's master, and if Zampha once served Zeric, could that mean... Careful. Empty speculation isn't very helpful. Are they trying not to do the RS3 thing, where they make... Like, isn't that an annoying thing in, like, RuneScape 3, some people think? Where, like, the like the gods just show up in, like, the storylines and you talk to them. And it's a bit... it's a bit weird. But in, like, old school, it's a bit more distanced. Uh, I don't know too much about RuneScape 3. I thought that was, like, one of the nitpicks people had. There was a bit less, like, mystery with it. Hmm. To what it's an option we could consider? Of course. If you can consider one option too closely, become blind to all of the possibilities. What we need is proof. How do I get that? I must ask you to pay a visit to the Tus... Ah, Tusakal at Mount Karalun. With their power, they can determine if Zampha is the same one that served Vatzeric. The power of the altar leaves traces. If the soul inhabits a body created when the dark altar... They can determine what it was formed. Do they not need his body? Ideally, but I suspect this will also work. Oh, it's the device. Since you destroyed it, we've been researching the device to determine the origin. We Now we know it was made by Xampha. Alright, I'll take it, but I need to ask for your support with the new accord. The council will be removed and a replacement is needed. I will gladly help. Is this a- this is gonna be a very long quest still, right? Like, do I have to do one of these for all the characters? You reckon? Like, I have to give them all a, a task? Um, yeah, yeah, this game's ancient. Or is it really just the Arceus one that's long? I think you're relatively near the end. Okay. I want to discuss the Royal Accord. Do you have any issues with it, considering it was your idea? It's messy business, but they do have to go. Oh yeah, this is the Hesidious guy. The new Royal Accord is our best hope. There are some preparations I need to make. Maybe you can help me with that. Okay. The Royal Accord of Twill, our new record, will see power transfer to the five houses, but only one of them will rule. The Royal Accord of Twill saw each of the houses take it in turns to do so, but this might take a different approach. I'm almost, uh, almost certain that Arceus and Priscarilius do not want to rule. Lovakanji probably won't, so it's me and Shazian. You want to take on the role? That's why my preparations come in. I can't say I'm too keen on ruling it. I'm not sure if Shazian's the right man for the job either. How come? Look through the pages of Karend history and you'll see that soldiers don't make for good rulers. So before any final decision made, there's something I want to look into with Shazian. What is it? 
As you probably won't be too surprised to hear, I have people who keep close eyes on things here. They let me know of anything interesting. Not too long ago, I was informed that Shazian went for a private walk in the woodland. He stopped off at a small barbarian camp. That's interesting. It is. I'm sure it's nothing to worry about, but I want to make sure. Okay. Yeah, like 2001. Yeah, right, old Uh, yeah, hello. Scorpions sting your bum when you're trying to mine early game, yeah. Yeah, the game's like, it's had like graphical updates over the years, but like... Not, not like disgustingly so, like the game's kept a lot of its original jank. Like if you angle the camera in such a way, your character will kind of clip through a wall. Like stuff they're never gonna fix. And like the weird little animations. kind of cute but like you know this armor I'm wearing is not original this is something they added in old school I think actually all this gear is pretty new pretty everything except the lunar the staff. stuff yeah lunar staff isn't even that what was that 2006 2005 how old's lunar diplomacy something like that yeah there you are I have something to discuss with you the royal accord correct once the council have removed we need a new ruler I for one think this records a perfect rule. I think we can establish that when the times comes, I will be a suitable candidate to rule. They are unstable times. A military leadership will put me in a good position to take over. Do you think the other leaders will support that? They surely consider me a strong contender. I think Hasidius will also be considered. On that note, there's a job I have that will be perfect for you. What is it? Before I finalise this accord, we need to be sure everyone's in the place they can pick the right ruler. While Hasidia seems like a good man, I've obtained an intelligence that could suggest otherwise. Look into it, please. What intelligence? Some of my people have been looking into the disappearance of Phileas Reimer and King Shazian VII journal. We've located both. See to the rescue of Phileas. I need you to recover the journal. But this is about Hasidius. It is. If our intelligence is to be believed, Hasidius has the journal. That doesn't make sense. Why would he want it? I don't know. He's meant to be an ally. He's married to my sister. Perhaps this is a plot to grow his influence. He may need to use the journal to discredit my family. I need you to retrieve it. Only then we can determine the truth. How odd. Do you know where he keeps it? He has a private office under the, vi the, vineyard, the vineyard. It's probably where he's keeping it. Okay. There's another person I need to talk to. Hello. Zygotes. The jank is charming, yeah. Cornelius is country that so shows up to rule the kingdom in his quest. Hell yeah. Hello. Hello, hello human. I need to talk about the accord. Are you willing to support it? Hmm. No, I don't think so. Why not? Why not what? Why can't you support it? Oh, the new one. Well, the counselor has been a good dwarf his whole life. He can't be involved in any of this. I know it's hard to hear, but I think he is. That's not right at all. You must be getting confused somewhere. Andrews is the problem. We can replace Andrews with Unkar. What a great idea. This calls for a sherry. You have to believe me. Unkar isn't innocent in this. You can't go believing Councillor Orson. He's just jealous of Unkar's success. God, look at this lady's face. That's horrifying. <laughs> She's part of the part of the RuneScape jank, apparently. He's just jealous of the councillor's success. Ah, how about I find some proof that the councillor is involved? Then will you support the accord? I suppose so, but I don't think you'll find any. The councillor is innocent. Okay. This is a tall, tall building. This is... ominous. I actually went in this building once thinking it looked cool, but it seemed weird that it was completely empty and had no benefit. I guess this is what it's for. Oh, look, there's redwood trees there. Why are there redwood trees there? I thought you only get redwood trees in the farming guild. Is that the woodcutting guild? Wait, can you do... You can do redwoods in the woodcutting guild? I guess I, so, yeah. I thought it was only a farming guild thing. What do you want? We need to talk about the Royal Accord. Don't waste your time, I'll never sign it. So you'll see the corrupt council stay in charge? Of course not, didn't you listen earlier? The people will decide, not us. There's a clear solution then, I doubt that. For it to be finalised, we can have the people vote on it. That way they get the final say. It would see us return to a single ruler. 
Only if it's what they want. If they vote no, we can come up with an alternative arrangement and let them vote on that instead. Ugh. If you do care for your people, this is the best option. It's a stupid move, but if there's a vote, I might be willing to support it. Might? Yes, there's something else we need to discuss. Of course there is. We were running around chasing dead princesses and mad mages. You've forgotten what started this. You summoned a demon in my home. No, I, keen I killed a demon that someone else summoned in your home. You should thank me. Thank you for being as useless as I feared. How about we skip the insults and you tell me what you want? The disciples of Yamo are in a big problem. They need dealing with. Tell Shazian to send the army. They literally live right on his doorstep. That's true. I live on his doorstep and he cares more about some stupid lizard men. The man is as incompetent as you. Thank you. You want me to take on this cult single-handedly? I feel like that won't go well. Of course I don't expect you to. Cut off the head of the snake. Remove the influence of their leader and they won't be a problem. Kill Yama? No, Yama has no presence among his followers. Not yet. If you remove their communication, he can't communicate with them. There's a mage in Arceus who's hopefully not as useless as you or Shazian. His name is Mori and he's investigating them. She should be able to help. How do you know all of this? I did some digging. Oddly enough, I wasn't going to ignore a corrupt counsellor summoning a demon on my dogs. You learned all of this with some digging? There's something you're not telling me here. Why would you care so much about this compared to everything else going on? The conversation is pointless. If you want my support, this is the price. Go and talk to Mori. She spends most of her time in the church. Alright. Good lord. You saw Osu today and started playing epic max that are like two to three stars in your gaming. Oh, hell yeah, Linlu. I should probably play that tomorrow. It's... I've been starting to dip again and not play. Like I've been saying, it's 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 happening. It's it, it's already been starting for a few weeks. The break. It always starts. It never. You never want it to start, and it always starts by itself. Any luck? I'm still working on it. You can do it. Need some help with the lady Liver Kenji. Wallop a cod. Nice word, Linley. You played. Gitchian Raw's Guile's theme? It was kind of Zoom. Nice. My ship, maybe I'll play it like tomorrow then, the day off. I'm, I'm gonna have to like re continue rebuilding from the start again. Probably. It's been a few weeks. Bloody video games. She doesn't believe that Counselor has anything to do with this. She wants proof before she signs. Oh, JoJo theme. Have you installed any skins or anything? Lately? Did you look through the uh, Bubble Man guide to get the minimum latency and stuff. Two of them are old friends. I've got nothing on him, but I think of one person who might be able to help. Martin? Exactly. His group has no doubt kept towers on all the counsellors. He's been arrested. I can't go break him out. No, but you can talk to him. You've helped the council enough. I'm sure no one would think much of it if you paid him a visit. Okay, I can claim I'm trying to round up more of his group. Nice idea. They went and took him to Shazy in prison. Good lord, this is a... This is a spicy, spicy long quest, huh? Good rewards at the end. I suppose so. This game is good music, yeah. I wasn't, I didn't know this was going to be like a two hour quest though. Um... Well, actually, let me just take a skills necklace out, actually. Come on, man. Let me get my necklace out. You didn't look into the latency, but you found a script that does it for you. Yeah, there should be stuff to automate it. I can play Sea Shanty 2 if you want it. There's a map of this in Osu that you can play in Lenly. 
It doesn't really fit with the serious theme of the quest, but we'll, we'll go with it. The human returns. It needs our help again. How do you know that? It's our place to know. Tell us what you desire. I was hoping you'd have a look at this device and tell me about who made it. Why? Why not? Why should we help? The device is the thing that was redirecting power from the Dark Altar. It really doesn't fit what I'm saying, does it? The person who made it was also responsible for the trapped soul that needed freeing. Meddling mortal, you have our attention. So we will help you. Hold still. And we begin. They magically inspect the device. Many have touched this device. Humans, Arceus, and two others. Two others? One touched by fire and one touched by darkness. It sounds like Xanfer. Can you tell how old he is? His body was born long ago. In the time of the Great Betrayer. You mean Zeric? Do not speak that name. It has no place here. You know of him? We know all too well. Is that who you speak of? Yes. So Arceus was right. What about the other person who touched it by fire? One of many. One born of Arceus. Now a child of fire. Pyromancer? Hang on, we recently helped repair some damage to the Doors of Din. Was the Pyromancer the one responsible? Impossible to say, but coincidence is unlikely. What's to stop them doing it again? We have to do something. We have no part in this. We have already helped you. Keeping the balances between life and death, that's your thing, isn't it? If the Winter Tot escapes, it will destroy all life in Karend. That doesn't sound very balanced. That's a valid point. It's been known to happen. Very well. The Dark Altar powers the Doors of Din. We understand this power. We can reinforce them to prevent further sabotage. How? Take a defense potion, add a volcanic sulfur, and return to us. Dude. Air unbalanced. That, that seems a little out of the blue, doesn't it? Take, take an ordinary level 1 defense potion. Add some volcanic sulfur. Alright. Volcanic sulfur. Defense potion 3. I think it needs to be a regular defense potion. Oh, this is a super defense. Super yeah. defense. Did you do the same thing? Well, I didn't have any defense potions in my uh, inventory, so I had to make one. Wow! Wasting a, a valuable Ranar weed. Oh my god. Oh, it's a Ranar weed. Oh my god. That's an expensive defense pot. Am I evoking yeah, the I poison? Think it's... Oh, god, sorry. Yeah, I think it's Ranar weed with white berries as opposed to snake grass. But that's sad. Am I going to continue the Simpsons hit and run? No. I mean, we basically finished it, right? I I was done with that. I'm glad you enjoyed it enough to want a continuation there. The human returns. I have the potion. Hold still and we will begin. They enchant the potion. It is done. Take this potion and put it on the doors of Din and your work is done. Okay. They let you drink the potion. Or does your character like stop themselves? Hit Nadrun. Don't do that. Game's necklace. Winter top. Look, Wrath, a Dark Souls reference. I called you Wrath. Can I call you Wrath, like anger, instead? There you go. There's a little Dark Souls. I don't know if my face was covering it. What, uh, campfire? Yeah. I never played a Dark Souls game. I'm disappointed, Tom. <laughs> what are you doing with the doors? I'm not, Go on, I'm not a good gamer, so I struggle with hard games. I think you're an epic pog gamer. <laughs> Fight and I'm kill. Good at, I'm good at strategy games. That's about it. I think you're a strategic M M R F. What does that mean? Mother hacker. <laughs> All right. <laughs> 
All right, let's go kill this Barbie. Oh! <gasps> Has anyone ever called the Barbarians Barbies before? Because they definitely should. But they should credit me with that. It's my original idea. Barbie village. I'm a Barbie, Barbie assault. Girl in a Barbie world. Imagination, life is your creation. Attack the barbarian line. Oh, 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 oh. People just vibing here. I didn't even know this place existed. Hello, adventurer. Who's Phil Phileas? You shouldn't be here. Time to die. I don't know who that man is. Oh, this man has 80 health. I bought like my full like melee kit for him. He died in one spec. Pocket friend. Did I go small? Am I small? You came for me. Why are you here? The barbarians raided my home. They took me prisoner. I thought they were going to kill me, but why? One of them been paid to do it, but why pay for me to be captured? Do you have a journal? They took it from me. I don't think that's what this is about, do you? How very confusing. I need to talk with Lord Hesidius. What does he have to do with it? Who's this man? I don't remember who you are. There are a lot of barbarians outside, so I can't free you. I'll get you soon. Okay. I became small before teleporting. Oh yeah, you become very small. Very small. Small, small pottle house. He pose as well. You do, you T-pose and become small. That's uh, the American dream right there. <laughs> Yo. Tell me about the rabbits, George. Well, they T-pose and become real small. <laughs> then they go straight to Lonebridge. Martin. Don't let you talk to the prisoners. I'm here on council business. I need to learn more about his group. Oh yes, you helped out Hughes. Carry on then. How are things, Martin? Wonderful, there's free food and a bed. Can you believe it? Luxury compared to the Port Priscillius. Good lord. He's got a bucket for pooing in. I'm glad you keep your spirits up. I need your help with something. Down to business. As you can see, I'm a little indisposed. Apparently the right to protest isn't much of a right at all. Fair. It's just information I need. Things have progressed with the council. I can't say more, but we're close. I need information on Councillor Unkar. Nice work. From the moment I met, I knew you were something special. What info do you need? Anything proving his corruption? If I had information on his corruption, I wouldn't be stood in a cell. Anything you have would be helpful. There's a member of the Royal Society who has close dealings with the Councillor. He gives me regular reports, but I haven't seen anything of note yet. Things have progressed fast recently. Maybe he's had more luck since my imprisonment. And I'm stuck in here. Maybe you should go on my behalf. Where does the meeting take place? In the graveyard of heroes, look for a dwarf. Evil only triumphs when the good do nothing. Okay. Take on little adventures. You wish you could put your friends in your pockets. Take them on little adventures and hope you don't get shanked. Boy. That just makes me think of the bonus chapters of Ika Muzume, where she's like tiny Ika. She's extremely small. Little squid. Very small. Goes on adventures in the garden. What's going on here, huh? Hello? Oh, it's Linux. Hey, I'm still doing I'm this quest. Back. How are you Welcome doing? Back, Linux. What are you doing here? Evil only triumphs when the good do nothing. Truer murders have never been spoken. Martin sent you, right? I wasn't sure if anyone would come after he got arrested. Are you with the Royal Society? How so? Also, hello, Linux. Are you well? Uh, well enough. Nice. Things don't seem too bad in Lovakenji with them in charge. They're in charge of Lovakenji, not the council. Sure, the councillor might act like he plays a big part, but it's empty words. Do you not get sick of her asking for sherry? Not really. It's not like it's a hard job. The councillor would see us all work to death in the mines instead. The councillor's why I'm here. I'm hoping you could give me some dirt on him. Any other day you'd be wasting your time, but today you're in luck. Due to the protests, the councillor has been staying at the castle for safety. I've had a chance to go through his private documents. I think you'll find- wait, what was that? Oh no, not again. Alright, stinker. You've been marked for death, dude. 
you've been marked for death, stinky assassin. Slapping him with those DDS specs. You okay? Oh, you're going to sleep now. Good night, Uni uh, not Unicorn. Good night, Lindley. Good work on beating the first two rated maps of Sea Shanty. Good work. Are you okay? I'm fine. Martin warned us this would happen. The council are trying to silence us. It's not safe for me here. I need to go back to Lover Kenji. Hopefully this will give you what you need. Declaration from the council. Thanks. Declaration. Only use if needed. We the council declare that the lady is no longer fit to rule. With immediate effect she is removed from her position and relieved of all titles. In her place, the councillor will rule the city. Signed, Andrews, Hughes, Orson, and Unkar, the current council. Oh, damn. Hot damn. Let me in this church, please, sir. I simply wish to pray. I need to get my dark essence and molten glass out, huh? get our Dark Essence and our Glass. You have a Xerix Talisman in your house? Uh, no, but I've got an Arceus library portal. Oh, you got it. Okay. It's come in handy a lot more than you'd think. You got a lot of teleports in your house. That I do. Things. I do, I do. I want um, the Camelot. When... Oh no, I want the um, Catherby one, but you need like level 90 or e something magic. Or 88. 87. 87? I'm not yeah, far... You... Go on, sorry. When you get uh, 72 construction, you can build a portal nexus. Yeah, it makes all the portals cost way more, place. doesn't it? Yeah. Well, I think it's it starts nice. with five of them. But it's more efficient than having like a million rooms for the various teleports. The rooms aren't so bad, are they? If you want to use my imbued heart, you can get the cat at the end right now. Oh wait, how much does the imbued heart give you? Uh, it's... I'm 81 it's magic. Like, it should be a plus 7 or 8 at your level, I think. Oh, maybe then. We'll you can't boost when you actually have the big nexus, unfortunately, but the portals you can boost for. Oh, nice. Uh, oh, it's a plus nine at plus nine. Magic. Yeah. How much are they? Like, Very expensive. <laughs> Thirty mil? Something like that. I haven't looked at mine for a while. Uh, Thirty-eight mil right now. Oh my word. I have a situation with the disciples. I hear you've been looking into them. Yes, the research was meant to be a secret. You're trustworthy, I suppose. What can I help you with? Do you know about Yammer? He's a mystery. He's a demon of sorts, but he doesn't have any presence. He's recently had no connection to the cult until recently. Yes, it sounds odd. They used to be known as the Disciples of Chaos. They were just a small Zamorak cult. Interesting. So he has no presence among his followers. How does he communicate with them? A being called the Voice of Yammer. If I killed them, would the cultists lose their connection? For a time, although I imagine the Voice would just be replaced. If you wanted to remove the connection, I have another idea. After what happened with Thana, I volunteered to help out with the Dark Altar. The device used was redirecting power from the altar, but a device could block the magical connection entirely. Ah, so we could use a device like that to block the connection between the voice of Yammer and Yammer himself. That's right. We've never tried it because the Dark Altar issues were more pressing, but I don't see why it wouldn't work. Where can I get one? I can make you one. I have some stuff right here. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> I like how that's part of the game that if you have what you need, they just give you a sarcastic comment. I, yeah, I love it when quests do that. Like One of them was like, so you just really happen to have these very specific items, and you're like, yes, I just happen to love carry. I'm like a die trader or something. Okay. Here you go. I believe in one of the um, Relica quests, you need two pigs of beer, and he calls you a bigger drunkard than he is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. Talk nullifier. Thanks, Mori. Enter the Chasm of Fire. I can just go through my house. That doesn't... Wait, hang on. Chasm of Fire is faster to go through a fairy, isn't it? Yep. Uh, CJR. Yeah. CJR? Right? Like 
Uh, DJ R. Oh, DJ R. Wow, Linux. A lava cave. Yeah. Th thanks, Rath. This is my fire cave. It's my molten cheese cave. Oh, wait. DJ R is uh, fallow. Fallow, I think. I don't know. I think I had clues on my mind. CJR is Sinclair Mansion. Yep, that's Fallow. Yeah, the lighting. Okay, Rath, I will be honest with you. I'm playing this game with a HD texture pack on. If I disable it, this is what the game actually looks like. No, don't pull back the curtain. Yeah, this is what the, this is the game we're actually playing. Don't. I mean, it still looks kind of pretty, and it runs really well. Oh, well, because you're in Karend, yeah. Karend looks nice, yeah, but. You play it with the uh, with the high def texture pack on, and suddenly the game looks so much better. This has only been around for like half a year, right? How did we ever play before the HD mod? I actually don't understand. We didn't know any better. It really is just a case of we didn't know any better, though, right? Like it looks so much better. You have this device as well. How nice. How do you? You become very tired. You need a good rest. Have a lie down. I'm being kidnapped. You wake up in the forest. That's the device hidden. Those disciples won't be a problem anymore. I'd better tell the lady. Okay. Inspect the eastern wine barrel in Hesidius. Alright. Also, I've got roofs turned off, Wrath. This game does have, like, roofs. So you can enable it and the, map, the, the game looks a little bit bigger. But you normally turn it off because it's kind of annoying for gameplay purposes to try and click inside of them. It's surreal how far we've come in games, yeah. It really is. I mean, having roofs on isn't so bad, but it's just this constant flicking that looks kind of annoying. And then you can have like the mods that make it so it hides the roof if you mouse over it, but I don't think it's much of an improvement. Climb in the wine barrel. Yo! Old journal. Talk to Arceus in the lookout. Hello. Have you spoken to the Tuscal? Yes, they've confirmed that this Zampa is the same one that served Zarek. It's as I feared, this isn't good. There's more. I've discovered they might have been working with the Pyromancer, who might have been involved with the sabotage of the Doors of Din. Do you know who? No. Oh, it's a purple person, and it's not Linux. They're level 69. Okay. Had the Doors fully failed, the Wintertop would have destroyed Karend. What would Zampa gain from that? I don't know, but the Tuscal confirmed it. I'll have someone look into it. We'll also use this knowledge to try and locate Zampha. The master would meet them in the south. Useful info. They mean the southern kingdom of Valamor. Valamor. Is that a new place that we haven't been to yet? Yeah, we haven't been to Valamor yet. We've heard of it before. But it's like the southern kingdom that Gren has traditionally been at war, at, or at war oh, with. Okay. We've learned all we can from Zampha for now. We need to turn our focus towards the council. We support the accord? I have no desire to rule myself. I'll support one of my fellow leaders. Cool. So yeah, with the like roofs turned on, this is a bit of a pain, but it's not so bad. The motion capture and facial tracking in Horizon Forbidden West is realistic. Use your money on indie games. Hey, yeah, it's a good place to use it though. Any luck on the barbarian camp? I had no idea what's going on, but something very strange. The barbarians has Phileas Roma prisoner. He needs to be rescued. Who's that? He's a retired soldier from Shazian. I helped him out with something a while ago, but he went missing. Turns out the barbarians were paid to take him. By who? We don't know. Is everything okay? You seem very unsettled. This is all very confusing. <laughs> Fair. Considering Shazian's presence at the cap, it's possible he had a role in it. That doesn't explain why he'd pay for one of his own citizens to be captured. When I was helping, Phileas involved a mysterious parcel containing King Shazian VII's journal. When Phylus was captured, it was taken by the Barbarians. Before that happened, I followed some clues in the journal. The discovery that King Shazian VII might have been responsible for the creation of the Lizardmen. Oh my word. The discovery at Quidda Mortem. It's all starting to make sense. I've long believed that Shazian VII eventually became Zarek. Oh shit. The discovery did little to suggest otherwise. He wouldn't have been too happy of a further evidence that Zarek was part of his family. He must have made arrangements to hide as much of that as possible. 
thank you. I think we have all the information we need. Probably best he disappear for a while on his own. I'll make the arrangements. What of Shazian? For now, nothing. We shouldn't keep this information to ourselves until the time is right. As for the accord, I'm ready to finalise things for you. Oh, damn. I can't believe Zarek is a uh, Shazian. Crazy. Hello, have you found the journal? I have it here. Nice work. It's sealed shut somehow. Don't worry. I should be able to take care of that. When the time comes to finalise it, I'll have the information. Cheers. Hello. Hello, human. I have a declaration from the council you should see. I don't understand. The council wants to remove me from power. They can't do that. Oh, the councillor. Do you see why we need to stop them? Yes, I suppose I will support it. Do you want to be considered for the throne? No. Fair enough. Hello there. Have you dealt with the disciples yet? Yes. Are you sure? Absolutely, there won't be a problem anymore. Good. Will you support the accord now? Yes, but it's a stupid idea and don't put me in charge. I don't want any part in it. I'll go talk with the commander. I've had enough of talking with you. Good lord. What a Rudy. He's a pain. It's very inappropriate. Hello. There's something you need to see. What is it? Let's come and have a look. Oh. The heck? Is he yes? What happened? Did he jump? I have no idea. You don't think he was pushed, do you? I don't think so. What do we do now? What can we do? Even if even Arceus can't bring back the dead. He's gone in that. Why did any of this have to happen? We can't undo what's been done, but we can still put an end to this. Does that mean you have good news? Kind of. I've managed to convince all the leaders to sign the accord. I don't know who they'll pick to rule. They'll make it work somehow. Maybe we can finally end the nightmare. I'll deal with the mess. Once I'm done, I'll gather everyone downstairs again. Big poly poly polygonal and old games make you want to play the original versions of remastered games like Medieval. Yeah, Medieval, nice. Nice bullfrog games. Have you played Flim Hospital? Bruh. I love that game. Where's Lord Hesidius and Shazian? Hesidius wants a private word with Shazian outside. I'm sure they'll be here soon. I think that's them now. Now everyone's here, I think we can begin. What of the counsellor? He is dead. What happened? He jumped from the top of the tower, probably. It doesn't matter, the world won't miss him, let's move on. That's very threatening. Not the attitude I'd take, but it's true we can't dwell on this. We need to focus on stopping the counsellor. You don't think you have? You've got to, bruh. You can get, um... There's a freeware version of Theme Hospital called, um... Theo or something? I don't remember. You can Google it. Theme Hospital Freeware. There's like a HD mod that lets it run on modern Windows and it's nice. It's free. I'd highly recommend it. Good good humour. Good classic bullfrog humour. Between the five of us, we can remove the council with little violence. But what then? Are we willing to support a new accord? Let's start with Arceus. What will it take for it to gain your support? I have a unique position. I feel like it would be inappropriate for me to involve myself too heavily, but I do support the decision made by the group. You don't want to rule yourself. I will advise the ruler in any way I can, but I don't want to take the throne. Look at Hesidius or Shazian for that. Piscarilius thinks it's a bad idea. You're all set on it, so I won't try and stop you. But I stand by what I said before, the people need a say. Anything we decide shouldn't be finalised until the people have voted on it. What about anyone else? I will be happy to have the people have a say. It would be a risky move. Without it, I'm not signing your precious document. If you don't sign, you get nothing. Very well. Assuming the people agree to the new accord, who do you think should rule? Not me, for sure. I can't imagine anything worse. Get one of the fools to do it. Lover Kenji? Huh? Me? What do you think? That's quite something. I suppose the council have to go through, though, don't they? Are you willing to take over? I don't think so. I think I'll have a sherry instead. Lord Shazian, what do you think? The accord of Twill is a good starting point. We need to make some changes for it to work. Like what? Piscarilius wants the support of the people. Right now they cry for a king. That means whoever takes the throne should have the title of king or queen. I think the act of transferring rulership from one house to the next, as in the original accord, isn't going to work. We need consistency. Are you open to taking the role yourself? No, I don't think that's wise. What? You seem like a perfect candidate. 
I feel like I would be best placed for it. I don't feel like I'll be best placed for it. It would be better if I kept my focus on the important task of protecting Karend. I suggest you make Hasidius the new ruler. The heck. Lord Hasidius? Thank you, Shazian. Taking the throne is not a duty to be taken lightly, but I think my family and I have what it is takes to shoulder the responsibility. Oh. Three Point Hospital. Three Point Hospital is like a fan game of it, I guess. Like, Three Point Hospital is like people that clearly really liked Theme, uh, theme Hospital. Sorry, Three Point Hospital is people who clearly liked Theme Hospital and wanted to make a modern like a modern indie game based on it or whatever. I don't know if it was indie, but yeah. Similar sort of thing. I don't know what mid means, but you know, it's got like the balloon disease where people get really big headed and you have to pop them. It's good. The decision will future forever change the future of Karend. If we go forward with this, the Hasidius family will be the new royal family of Karend. Not quite what I expected, but sure, let the idiot have his throne as long as the people agree. He can have it, I suppose. Hasidius is a fitting choice if no one else is willing. Are you sure? Yes. Sounds like we have an agreement. Thank you for putting your trust in me. The kingdom has suffered th through much of late, but I'm, now it's time for it to end. In honour of her sacrifice, I name the declaration Rose's Accord. With it, the kingdom will no longer be a kingdom divided. Yo. Mid means mediocre. Did people not like three point? I thought people liked it. What happened there? We might have a new king. Shazian, you seem like a perfect candidate, but you didn't want to be considered. What happened? I think I have an idea, but I'm a bit confused. Hasidius wants a word with you. Blackmail, dude. I no doubt you have some questions about what just happened. You can say that again. Sorry for keeping you in the dark. It wasn't anything against you. I couldn't afford to take any risks. You planned this, that's why you kept the royal accord. It was inevitable one day the council would fall. The rule has always been fragile. You made sure you'd be the one to replace them. It gives me no pleasure, but this was needed for the safety of Karend. Other than Shazi and the other rulers don't care, it was always going to be him or me. You didn't want to be him? For the safety of Karend, Shazi has a good military mind but is no ruler. After all, you saw what he did with Phileas. To Shazi family name is everything. Above all else, he craves glory for himself and his house. Under him, war will have been inevitable. With who? Ah, oh, the kingdom to the south. There we go. Our two kingdoms were in conflict less than 200 years ago, and relations are sour. I would take very little for that conflict to be reignited. Do you think Shazian would have declared war? Can't say for sure, but it was a risk I don't intend to take. How do you want to do it? A while ago, I managed to acquire the old journal of Shazian the Seven. I knew I could use it to discredit Shazian and his family, so I made some arrangements. Ah, Phileas, Phileas' mystery parcel, that was you. You acted like you didn't even know him earlier. Sorry for lying, it was definitely me. Had I have revealed the contents of the journal myself, I probably would have just been dismissed as trying to create a rift. Phileas was the perfect third party. But then Shazian had Phileas captured before he could reveal too much. This was all starting to make sense. He actually blamed you for that. Phileas' disappearance was an interesting twist. I hadn't expected something like that. It made things easier in the end. Once he was safe, I told Shazian I gave him a choice. You let him pick between supporting you or being exposed. Exactly. The truth about Phileas would have been lost him the support of the people and ruined his reputation. In the end, you never actually wanted to discredit him. What about the journal? Shazian had sent me to steal it from you, but surely he already had it. I didn't want him to risk losing the real journal. The one I sent to him was a copy with many bits removed. When I covered my tracks well, Shazian must have worked out I was involved and sent me to recover the real journal. Unfortunately, the one you stole was a fake. The real one is much safer. You thought of everything, didn't you? How about the Accord? That was essential. I'm guessing there was no accident that Arthur found it. I can't take too much credit from him there. He did most of the work himself. I'd been looking into the Accord for a while and Arthur found my research. When he went missing, I feared the worst. It was a nice surprise that not only you brought him back, but also the Accord. It's a lot to take in, I don't know if I like any of it. Nor do I. But when it comes to politics, there's no perfect options. Instead, we can all we can do is pick the best option we have. Anyway, we have plenty of time to discuss this later. For now, the council has to be dealt with. You should speak with the count commander. God, I've done so much talking today. Not one of your kinds of games where you wouldn't knock anyone for lighting it. Oh, fair enough. I think it's a very fun little old, old sim game with some good humor and a great soundtrack. There was only ever one option for Karen's new ruler. 
We'll talk about that later. Let's go to the council. How are we doing this? We'll join the five leaders and head there. We'll tell the councillors everything and present the accord to them. You think they'll come quietly? They wouldn't have a choice. Shazian commands the guard and I command the royal guard. There's no one to protect them. What happens then? They'll be imprisoned. It will be for the new ruler to decide their fates. As for that, we aim to hold the vote Priscilius requested as soon as possible. Assuming the people support it, we can have Hesidius crowned in a few days. Do you think they'll support it? I think so. Many are calling for a king and Hesidius is popular everywhere. We have it covered then. What do we do? The protest is coming to a breaking point. We can't wait any more time. Okay. Let's go. Nice. Final cutscene. Aggressive. Hold the line. Under no circumstances can this castle be breached. Captain, they're citizens. Did you hear me? Hold the line. Hold the line. Show everyone who you really serve. We serve Karend. You are in violation of the laws of the kingdom. Laws set by your false council. If you really served Karend, you wouldn't be defending those monsters. Step back. Or what? You'll kill me. Go on, I dare you to do it. See what happens. You can't kill us all. Stand back, I'm warning you. Oh lord. You haven't played The Sims in two or three years. Hmm. Hmm. Stand down. The situation is under my command. What's going on? The citizens are to be protected. Ensure they don't enter the castle, but don't allow any harm to come to them. Alright. Thank you. Myself and the other leaders will go and speak to the councillors. The situation will be resolved soon. Ah, Shazian, good to have you here. Hopefully with your support we can get this protest under control. I must say, I'm confused as to why everyone else is here. What's happening? There'll be one way to describe it, Lord Hesidius. Councillor Andrews, Councillor Unkar, we are here to pre present a joint declaration from the five houses of Karend. I don't understand. What was the hum for? The hum was like a... Gotta play some sims, right? <laughs> Gotta play some smin some, some smims. Um, Android underscore dragon guard. There we go. We, the leaders of the five houses, declare that you are no longer fit to rule, so you are immediately re relieved of your positions. What the heck? Furthermore, hand yourselves over to Shazian's soldiers. They will take you into custody where you await your trial. Have you gone mad? For the crimes and murder and high treason, along with the now deceased Liam Orson and Sophia Hughes, the two of you have successfully conspired to murder King Karatst the sixth or the fourth? I think that's the fourth and crown princess rose liam's dead this is insanity guards arrest him soldiers of the royal guard you serve the rightful ruler of karend this is not this man stand down and step aside yo you can't do this david it's over over only when i decide it's over i'm the rightful ruler and you will answer to me guards oh heck guards walking up Stay away from me. This is my throne. I worked too hard for it for you to just take it away. I'd rather die. Do it. Oh, heck. No! Oh, they killed him. Or they knock him out. Take them away. You have some old characters that you'll end up cringing at, but it would be a neat stream to eradicate your old family. Why don't you make a nice little swimming pool and take away the ladder? Oh, look who it is. A classic. What is, what is this? <laughs> a classic. The classic murder method. <laughs> yeah. The last part says, Swimming until they die. Yeah. Truth be told, there were times I'd wonder if this day would ever come. We could also put them in a house with a fireplace and a bunch of cheap wooden furniture and remove the front door. Or just have a small room with no door and they starve to death. Yeah, there's a lot of good ways to do it. You could have someone <laughs> with like no mechanics, mechanical skills try and repair a broken like cheap TV and they'll electrocute. Yeah. <sighs> Everything and more, my friend, and I think they even let us vote on it. Fantastic. The king has attracted plenty of guests. It seems. Now everyone wants to congratulate him. Or oh, they're just here for the food. Yo, it's ceramic vase. King rolled. It's everyone. Duke Horatio? This will be an event for the ages. Are all the leaders here as well? Most of them. Shazian was here earlier, but left. He didn't look to be enjoying himself. 
Not surprisingly, things weren't exactly straightforward between him and the king. Yes, there was a bit of drama here and there, but that's Karen for you. Let's go mingle. I'm sure the king will want a word with you at some point. Have fun, Martin. I hate that you can barbecue babies in The Sims. Excuse me? We must have played different versions. Good to see you. Or you could have them look through like a telescope until they get taken up by aliens. That would work. Any news on Xanfer? Nothing yet. We managed to search his lair in Mulch. Oh yeah, we didn't actually kill him, did we? Most of it had been cleared out before we arrived. There was some research left behind. Notes on new spells. Some are too dangerous, but others are safe. We're preparing a tome of all the ones that are suitable. We'll give you a copy once we're done. Nice. It's all we can do after you've done for us. That's a nice law reason for getting a new a new uh, spell book. Lots of very nice spells on there. Is it a different spell book or is it just an extension of Arceus? Extension of Arceus. Okay. And the Arceus ones got reworked. That's it, yeah. It's not every day you crown a new king. You can say that again. You should have seen all the preparations. Food, drinks, entertainments, invitation, the list go on. You'd think security would be one of the hard parts, but I reckon our bits are pretty straightforward. How does it feel to be serving a king now? Not quite sunk in yet. It feels like it's only happened this morning that Councillor Hupes escaped. So much happened in such a short time. Tell me about it. Had I known this would go when Martin first recruited me, I probably would have considered running for the hills. I'm glad you didn't. We wouldn't have reached this point without your help. It wouldn't have been possible without you or Martin either. Have you two spoken yet? I'm going to need to, a lot to drink before I'm ready for that conversation. Fair enough. Have you seen our special guest? The chicken? Oh, Sidious. He's got his big coat on. It's a pleasure to meet you, great Karend Queen... Queen Zayayani? Oh. The pleasure uh, They're from Parlamore. Yeah, they, they, they're, they're the opposite kingdom, aren't they? Fair enough. The pleasure is all mine. From today, the sun will shine on our two kingdoms once more. The mistakes of the past are behind us. Who is she? Oh, there you go. The Sun Queen. She is the ruler of Valamor, this kingdom to the south. This is her first visit here. First visit? Yes, the king invited her. He's been to put an end to the animosity between them. She feels the same way. Who are the knights? The Kualati. They look fancy. They do. If stories are true, they're the best fighters there. Not jealous, are you? Not of that armor, it looks uncomfortable. Damn. I guess they meant to look like Roman legions a little bit. You should go and speak to the king. You want to have uh, a swim? Old school. What? The old school dev said that the next current quest is quest line continuation is going to take place in more Yeah, I'll be exciting. Sorry. I'll wait for 10 years when that comes out. That'll be fun. Yeah, I actually had like a massive fear of aliens as a child, and like having my sims randomly get abducted by aliens was definitely not helping that. Especially because they would get impregnated or get killed or whatever. It was not very nice. You just look in like the bottom left of the screen at their like head, but it would be them like in horror. It wasn't nice. Congratulations on your coronation. Thank you, none of this would be possible without you. Let it be known that you'll always be a friend to the kingdom. I'm very honored. As am I, this calls for a toast. Gather round, guests. It's time for me to bore you with a speech. Nice. Yo. This guy's got the proper Guthen bod. What we all dream of. Exactly. Thank you for joining me on this special day. This is the beginning of a new chapter for Karend, and I couldn't be more grateful for you all to be here. Let's not forget the hard road that led you here, nor those that were brave enough to walk along it. Martin, Lydia, will he he. Without you, we would all be living in ignorance. You opened our eyes and ensured a strong future for Karend. Let's raise our glasses. Fire in the Sky is a hecked up movies, but the aliens are cool. Oh, oh it's night time. There you are. You wanted to talk to me. I did. Sorry for taking you away. With everyone else celebrating, I thought it would be a good chance to talk in private. It won't take long. What do you want to discuss? The councillors are behind bars and the current has a new ruler. On the surface, all is well again, but that's not the case in reality. You mean Xanfer? Yes, the council didn't act alone. They weren't even the true orchestrators. We need to find and deal with a real foe before it's too late. I'll be happy to help. We have unfinished business. I was hoping you'd say that. This is a serious threat we're facing. I need people I can trust. What do you need me to do? Nothing for now. I just wanted to make sure you were on board. Once we have more information, I'll let you know. Let's head downstairs before we are missed. Alright. Oh shit! 
Everything all right? I can't. Oh, no. Asidious, you have been marked for death. Oh, Lord. Wait, was he, was he, was he murder murdered? If a see-through torso and you can see their organs. Oh. Hey Lydia, how are you doing? It's been a rough few days, as you can imagine. One moment we were crowning a king, the next minute we were burying him. I'm doing okay though, work is a good distraction. How's that going? Well, Hasidius is now the king of Great Herend. Sure you couldn't be there for the ceremony, after what happened they felt something small would be for the best. That's fine, one coronation's enough for me. Any word on the killer? No shortage of suspects, but nothing solid. We had the murder weapon sent over to be examined. They have a theory, but they need more work. Let me know, I need to find whoever did this. Anything else in the meantime? I don't think so. Arceus is trying to find out more about Xanfer, but he doesn't know anything yet. All we can do is wait. I want to give you something for all that you've done. It's a bad situation we're in, but without things, without you, things would be a lot more worse. Arceus also sent something over for you. He said you'd know what to do with it. Thanks again. Yo. Book of the Dead. Respawn point. Scratch, scratch. Spells. Scratch, scratch. Yo, 269 spells books. How much is this lamp worth? Uh, 10k. I'll just chuck it in a jail or two. Yeah, it's 10k. Nice. Book of the Dead, huh? Is that the replacement for the memoirs? Yep. Uh, it holds up to 60 teleports, and you need it to cast the Thrall spells. Oh yeah? Even though it's not actually a listed requirement, but you still need it. It's kind of stupid, but whatever. Okay. Well, that's dope. Is there anything I need to do post-quest to get any more rewards? Or is that? That's there. Because uh... sometimes they make you like talk to an NPC or something. Uh, nope, nothing else. You can set your spawn point to a friend if you want. I don't know if I want that. Where do they spawn you? Like, just here in the castle, or...? I'm not entirely sure, actually. I haven't tried it. I'm surprised it's not part of the... I guess it's not part of the Achievement Diaries, because this quest only came out, like, last year. Yeah. Oh, anyway, that's, that's uh, one more quest out of the way. I've still got to do the new Desert Quest. Dark Dragon Slayer 2, Monkey Madness, Night at the Theatre, Sins of the Father, and Song of the Elves. Is finishing with Song of the Elves the most um, sensible one? Like, is that the most... That or, like, Dragon Slayer, right? Yeah, it, those two are usually uh, people's, one of the people's best, too. So. I think I'll do Dragon Slayer sooner, though. You should have Rack and Bone Man 2 as your final quest. I mean, it's, it, at this rate, it's going to be. Um, I should probably <laughs> fix that. No, I, I'm pretty sure Rack and Bone Man was my original last quest as well, so... It's just not, not a bad quest to end on. It's not very epic, <laughs> though, is it? Running around killing <laughs> like rats, it's... bats, wolves, ogres. It's literally like pocket dust. The quest. <laughs> and that's why you should end with it. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I think I need to do sins of the father as well because I want to unlock the hallowed sepulcher. Hallowed sepulcher, whatever. I'm level... Is it level 72 you unlock floor 3? And that's probably when it's a good time to start doing Sepulchre, right? Uh, yeah. That'd, that'd be a good, good place to start. Because I can already do the floor 2, but I might as well get Yeah, no. Floor, floor 2 is not super worthwhile. Yeah, fair. Well, anyway. Um, for now, I'm going to end my stream. Thank you everyone for watching. Sorry we didn't get around to playing your um, the, the Theatre of Blood thing, but I've got work tomorrow and I'm tired. Okay. It's half eleven. Um, did you all enjoy the, the RuneScape today? Sorry we weren't really playing together, Tom Bowser, so much as I was just playing it. That's alright. I was watching the stream and writing witty commentary. Hell yeah. As always, right? Yes. Witty right. banter. Witty banter. I've been watching Joel play Signal Simulator and it's an adventure. He has a fear of aliens too and got tormented by chat telling him to check the bathroom. Moy. Alright, well anyway, I'm gonna head off for now. Um thank you all very much very much for watching. We'll be back tomorrow or Wednesday, I haven't decided yet. 
Um, oh, someone's dumping all their crap on the floor. I got like 120k in like something really good the other day just off the floor. I don't know what it was, but it had like a green Hoover text. Yeah, I did Hoover it up. There was a snap <laughs> Snapdragon seed that I was actually trying to pick up. And then I instead got this other thing because he put it down just as I click. That was nice. Take care. Yeah. I'm going to head off for now. Good night, everyone. Have a nice snooze. See you soon. Good night, cats. Bye-bye.